God, I have like five tabs open. <laughs> I had like five tabs open on my own stream, trying to get my uh, the chat and everything, and a bunch of other things. And the music, I was hearing the the the, the opening music like five times. It was it was really bad. <laughs> but yeah, hi hi everyone. Fine, not as bad. It was blaring. It was really loud. <laughs> it was like blaringly loud. And five times, it, it was not good. No scare this time, no. It's it's Saturday. It's EP day. <laughs> it's EP day. It is the day of the week in which I'm the most EP. Tiaki and the ultra surround sound. Not not a good idea. Do not recommend. Mm -mm. I thought yesterday was EP day. Why yesterday? Oh, also yesterday. <laughs> But Saturday is always EP day by default. 
Uh, yesterday was just default. Um, no, yesterday it was, um... <laughs> it just happened to be an AP day because I ate, um... I ate very filling food. Saturday be the day for eating. Exactly! Saturday is just the day for eating. Every day is EP day if you have a bad sleep schedule. <laughs> you know what? You make a fair point. No, I said yesterday was inter International Sleep Day. Oh, well, yeah, that is true. Oh, so hi, hi, Alicia. Welcome, welcome. I mean, I guess yesterday was officially EP day. Like, you know. Official, official, for real, for real. Yeah, hi, hi, everyone. I need to stretch. I woke up like, what? An hour and 30 minutes ago? And I didn't want to get up. <laughs> I didn't want to get up. The bed was too soft. So I was like, mm, do I have to get up? I guess I have to get up. He slept in late. <laughs> uh, I might have, yeah. I might have actually slept in late. Maybe. There's a high possibility that is the case. And yeah, I didn't want to get up. Tiaki. I feel that hard to resist the call of YouTube and blankets. It's strong. It calls you. It beckons you. Good morning, good morning, hello, welcome, welcome. Oh god, it's uh... It just be that type of day, you know? You know, you know. I mean, Saturday especially, I feel like it feels especially like a lazy day. I mean, I guess Sunday too, but I don't know. I feel like, I feel it strongly with Saturday. Rather than Sunday. I slept in too... I slept in two, got up at 11. Normally I'm up at like 8. It's just... That's just the Saturday vibes, you know. Always getting up late. <laughs> I was pretty eepy this morning. Try to take a walk to help me wake up. I mean, that, that can also help, yeah. Taking a walk. But I'm too... I'm too eepy to take a walk. Uh, no. I was... I was not feeling it. I wish I could get up late on weekends. Man... It do be like that, huh? I feel you. I just woke up from a nap and I'm still a little sleepy. I don't even take naps that often. I think recently I took a nap, but that was only because I was having a really bad headache. <laughs> but other than that, I don't really take naps. It's only... it's only when I'm feeling like sick or under the weather. But it's Tiaki gotta take us on a walk? What do you mean? I'm taking you guys on walks. I'm taking you guys on walks. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Every time I take a nap, I ruin my sleep schedule for like a week. Yeah, naps tend to ruin my sleep schedule even more. <laughs> so, I, I don't usually take naps because of that. Hope the headache is gone. Yeah, that was like a... That was last week. No, actually, no. It was a couple weeks back. Not even last week. I don't think being trapped in Disneyland counts as a walk. What do you mean? There's a lot of space to walk in in Disneyland. It's a very big park. <laughs> it's a very big park. You, you guys... You guys walked around Disneyland. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, they do that. For sure, yeah. I know... I know a lot of people that can take naps and still, you know... And they're still able to sleep at night perfectly fine. I wish I could do that. Once to learn a fast travel, the cat students didn't walk at all. <laughs> no, no walking. Just immediately... I'm in! Teletransportation. Walking is overrated now, naps. <laughs> thank you so much for the tip. For d -Mops. Thank you, thank you. That's where it's at. I, I wish I could take naps, but my, my brain doesn't allow it. It's like, no, you could be doing something right now. Anything. Except naps. <laughs> it's only when I'm really tired. Like, really, really, really tired. Also, hi, hi, Himo. Welcome, welcome. 
And hi, hi, tech girls. Welcome, welcome. But yeah, I, I wish I could just fall asleep like that. You know, those people that fall asleep on command, they're just like, I'm gonna fall asleep. And then they fall asleep. That's... That's insane. I wish I could do that. Phone. My phone died for a second. Don't worry about that. <laughs> just don't listen to it easy. I, I cannot. I cannot. I wish I had that superpower. Me too. Why is my phone lagging? Okay. Is it low on battery? Uh-oh, that's not good. How much battery do you have? Oh, right, I can't check. <laughs> that's annoying. It's a full battery! What do you mean? You could ask the professional napper for tips? Who's the professional napper? Welcome to Nylena. Osohimo! Thank you so much for being a member of Nylena for eight months. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for always being fun, amazing, and precious to all Katsurans. You're wonderful and excellent. Oh, thank you so much, Himo. That's super sweet. Thank you. <laughs> Tibiaki surprise cameo? No. Not... no. <laughs> I don't know who, but in Spain, there's a big napping competition. Wait, they actually have competitions. How does that work? How does a napping competition actually work? Like... How... How? Do you just like... Everyone is just sleeping there and it's like, okay... Any moment now... Any moment now... <laughs> like, how, how does that even work? Is it like the first one that wakes up or do you have to stay asleep for a certain amount of time? The most underwhelming competition ever is like... Oh, would you look at that? That guy's about to wake up. And he woke up. It's over. <laughs> like, I, I don't I don't know how you can make that interesting. I have insomnia, so I already lost before entering. Me. Literally me. They also had that tomato fight. There's a tomato fight? Huh. Is it kind of like dodgeball, but with tomatoes? Who can sleep the longest, or do they go around trying to wake them up and see who's the deepest sleeper? <laughs> they grade sleeping position, quality of sleep, and how fast they fall asleep. But how can you rate quality of sleep just from, just by looking at someone, though? H how are you able to tell that? The crowd roars with applause, thus waking up all the remaining competitors. <laughs> It's so much for that. They just all wake up. It's like, oh, you did it! And then they wake up and I'm like, oh. <laughs> they use Pokemon sleep. I think a tomato fight is closer to a snow fight. That must be so messy. That must be like such a mess to clean up. I wouldn't want to be the person that has to clean up afterwards. Sleeping position? Ah, yes. Look at his perfect form. A perfect bad sleeping position. I think that's a 10 out of 10. <laughs> oh, would you look at competitor number 4? He is clearly a rookie when it comes to the napping competition. As you can tell, his sleeping position makes all the mistakes that every rookie would make. <laughs> like, I, I, I don't know what would you even say. How do you even narrate those competitions? <laughs> But for real, the sapping competitions will be interesting to participate. Hmm, I can see it. Also, hi hi, Ugo. Hi hi, Pharrell. Welcome, welcome. And hi hi, Star Pop. Welcome, welcome. It's very messy. The pictures of it are always just rivers of tomatoes splatter everywhere. Ooh, that must be such a pain to clean up. Oh man, the better number five was in a roll, but then he failed the side roll. That's gonna hurt his score. <laughs> yeah. You would narrate them to begin with? I mean, they usually narrate competitions. I guess usually if it, you know, they're broadcasted. I don't know if this is broadcasted. But, you know, if you broadcast a competition, you would usually, like, have a narrator. So I'm trying to figure out, how would you even narrate that? I guess you'll be whispering all the time. If they don't narrate, you're literally just watching people sleep. Exactly! You're literally just watching people sleep, so you'll need a narrator. 
I think you just broadcast him. Maybe like the golf competitions. Yeah, so you have to have a narrator then. If it is broadcasted. You have to narrate in a whisper so you don't wake up and you... <laughs> oh god. And then you just see them like turning... Every, all the other people watching, they'll have to turn up the volumes on their TVs or in their computers. Because the... The narrator is just whispering. Because he doesn't want to wake up the competitors. And then the crowd cheers and the volume just peaks. <laughs> ASMR sleep competition narration. I'm kind of curious, honestly. Let me see. Can I actually find the video? Napping competition. Spain. The National Siesta Championships. Okay, I found them. The National Siesta Championships. Wait, that's a real competition? It is. It's in Spain. It's called La Tomatina and it lasts like an hour. Always held on the last Wednesday of August. How specific? They throw tomatoes at each other, that's it. <laughs> that sounds silly, but also very messy to clean. Yeah, thank you so much for the super himo. Thank you, thank you. Calling it championships is so funny to me. <laughs> yeah, the national siesta championships. Mm -hmm. Before the tomatina, they have palo jabon, a piece of ham on top of a grease pole. They have to work together, and when the ham falls, the tomatina stop. <laughs> that actually sounds kind of funny. Like it's kind of, it's like a, a fun competition to be fair. Spain's national siesta championship. You can win up to 1,500 euros in the championship, in the National Siesta Championships. All that money could be yours if you win. <laughs> Man, I have to go to Spain now. 1,500 euros for being able to nap? If you win the National Siesta Championship, you can win up to that. Mm -hmm. That's what it says over here. I gotta sign up, literally winning money in your sleep. <laughs> that is crazy. Wait, I wanna see a better picture. This picture's gonna... They sleep on like these couches. Interesting. Oh, this is very interesting. I thought they slept more on like... Futons maybe? But they kind of sleep on like these couches. I'm so bad at sleep though, probably baby not to show up on you. Man. It truly it truly do be like that. I I'm not a I'm not a good sleeper. I would be disqualified. They'll be like, oh god, her form is so bad. <laughs> she moves too much on her sleep. I'm gonna get the picture, but it's so weppy. I need to use the web pizza PMG. You could ask tips from the professionals. Do you think they will share their secrets with me? <laughs> I wake up so quick, honestly. Me too. I am a very light sleeper, so... I would wake up pretty easily. I wouldn't be able to win. Rolling off the couch, instant disqualified. Apparently you have to fall asleep in 20 minutes? Oh, yeah, it's so over. <laughs> Does snoring get bonus points? Not sure. Not entirely sure. They have an official page. It's an official thing. Only the most serious of serious nappers can participate. <laughs> now, I'm pretty sure it's open for like, public. Easy, just don't sleep for like 24 hours. <laughs> I feel like that would be pretty bad. That might not be pretty good. Can you please increase it to 40 minutes? I need like an hour to fall asleep. I, I can't do it in 20 minutes. It's it's Jover. That's too little time. I need more time. Why are there all these images whoopish? It's not only sleeping but waking up waking up within the time limit. I mean, do they have like an alarm? I'm assuming they do. They have like an alarm and you gotta wake up. I mean, I could do the waking the waking up part uh, just fine. 
<laughs> because I'm a light sleeper, but just not the, the other section, the actual sleeping. Oh, so, hi, hi, Eclipse. Welcome, welcome. Therein lies the issue. I can do this, I can do the waking up. I just can't do the sleeping. <laughs> oh, no. Let me see. What be the end Can't wake up if you never fall asleep to begin with, but then you can't win. You can't win if you don't fall asleep. Also, hi, hi, Novi. Welcome, welcome. Was you one session this game? I'm pretty sure. I think this game is pretty short. I think we can finish it pretty easily. I'm trying to find the picture I got from the Siesta Championships. Where did it go? Where did I save this thing? Oh, it's on my desktop. Pretty sure after six hours. I mean, it's still a one stream. It's still one stream. It's not. It's not that long. Also, oh, hi, hi, Harib. Welcome, welcome. Jackie's winning the best cat hacker competition every year. Wait, there's a cat hacker competition. I did not know about that. This whoopee is too powerful. The converter cannot work with it. She has finally accepted the short six hour streams. I mean, I would I, <laughs> I would like to make shorter streams, I feel, because um it must be a pain to watch through the VODs. So I I would like to do that, but I don't know how I would make it work. Honestly. I feel like you'll feel very sudden. It's like, okay, time's up. Bye bye. <laughs> uh, so it, it would just feel weird. It'll feel awkward, I feel. Okay, let me put this here. Siesta. Okay, I found the thingy. I found the thingy, Majiki. Here. Here these are the couches that I was talking about. These are for the for the siesta championships in Spain. They sleep on these couches. They actually look very uncomfortable though. They don't look that comfy. <laughs> so I think that, that must that must make it harder to fall asleep. We need the eight hour bots for the whole workshop. <laughs> Long Tiaki bots are great, what do you mean? Nah. <laughs> Those couches look hard, they do. They look like really hard couches. Naps are normally taken on the couch. What do you mean? I've always taken naps on the bed. On the bed, not on the couch. Uh, the one and only time I witnessed a siesta competition was in a kill on the anime. It's a real thing in Spain. It could spice up the competition by deploying the couch eating subsection of katsudons to this. Let's see who can sleep through those doors. <laughs> you just you see a katsudon chomping on the side. <laughs> is the staff guy taking notes? I think he is, yeah. He's like, okay. Your sleeping position? Not that good. The most basic uncomfy couches possibly. They probably taste horrible. <laughs> yeah, all of them are almost sleeping in the same position except the guy at the far left. The guy at the far left, he's sleeping the other way. Arm angle is off, minus five points. <laughs> Uh, I love the staff taking notes in the high tiers. He's so silly. <laughs> it, it seems really silly, yeah. He's just on his on his high chair while everyone's just sleeping. He's taking notes. Do they ban snoring? I wonder. I think uh, I thought I'd mention they had a website. But National CS uh, Champion. I'm trying to see what the rules are. Second guy from the left looks like the bro. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. 
siesta. God, I forgot how you say championship in Spanish again. Competencia Nacional de Siestas, no sé. I, I don't know how you say this thing. It's a campeon yeah, that's the word, campeonato. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> campeonato de Siesta. What is the official name for this? Uh, is it just like Campeonato Nacional de Siesta or something like that? What, 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 what is it in Spanish? The judges do apparently get bonus points for snoring, drooling, and funny sleeping position. <laughs> oh my god. The guy on the far left looks like he's trying to protect himself from snoring. Oh, I can see it. Also, hi hi, Himmo! Welcome, welcome! Uh, hi hi, Hero! Hi hi! Uh, Sandra is a competent side sleeper. Pillow between legs for lumbar alignment. He knows what he's doing. He knows. Uh, although Tiag is for goring Spanish, I forgot! <laughs> oh, it is Campeonato Nacional de Siesta. It's too early. I'm trying to juggle between two languages. Caminato Nacional de Siestas. I put it in plural, but don't worry about that. <laughs> Is this the website? Looks very unprofessional. Do anyway, um... Uh, oh, it's nine days. Interesting. Uh, is this the website? Just gonna go to the website. This is how their website kind of sucks. Why is it not logging in? Oh, it's not working. Okay, guess I'll use the ugly website. <laughs> I'll use the ugly website. They told me there was an official link, but I couldn't. I couldn't access the link. It's not working. Okay, there is the the scoring system. It says, uh, obviously the first one to fall asleep has the most points. Uh, sleeping during 20 minutes, it's 20,000 points. <laughs> Wait, what is it? What do you mean by estar tumbado? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> estar tumbado? Wait. What do you mean by this? I feel like this is slang for something. What do you mean estar tumbado? <laughs> Wait. Is it just laying down? Isn't that just as... <laughs> I guess it's laying down. Okay, I guess laying down for 20 minutes is 5,000 points, so yeah. Wait, depending on your outfit, you also get points. Yeah, your outfit is worth a uh, max of 5,000 points. So if your outfit is like not meant for sleeping, you're out. Well, not, 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 not that you're out, but you have less points. But yeah, your outfit uh, is part of the scoring system. Man, I better get the fancy suit. I'm assuming if you get pants, it's better though. It's like, you know, more comfy for sleeping. But yeah, um... Your outfit is worth a maximum of 5,000 points. How would a Chiagi cosplayer score? Uh, not, not very good. <laughs> not very good. I don't think my outfit is that comfy for sleeping. Uh, snoring in the middle of... Snoring in the middle is a maximum of 5,000 points. And obviously, you, you gotta fall asleep. You gotta actually snore while falling asleep. To... To actually get those points. And then it says, the most original sleeping posture... Gets 7,000 points. And obviously, if you're the, the public's favorite, you get an extra 5,000. Yeah, you do get uh, bonus points for snoring. But obviously, you gotta be asleep for that. You can't just, like, lie down and snore. That's, that's not how it works. Crystal, hi hi, Shido! Welcome, welcome! Mm -hmm. And hi hi, uh... DJ, welcome, welcome! Man, point for Riz, these people. Yeah, so your your outfit can be worth up to a maximum of 5,000 points. Yeah, no fake snoring. Don't you dare to fake snore. Mm -mm. 
Oh, so hi, hi, LCD. Uh, let's see. Those are. I'm reading. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you sign in, you upset the rules. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Oh wait, so this is kind of like a gift card. You got a gift card. I thought you actually get the money. What? It says that you do get like the 1,500 euros, but it's to spend on fashion. On the Centro Comercial Isla Azul. <laughs> so to pretty much go to the mall. The, the Isla Azul mall. So you don't actually get the money? It's just to spend on fashion? Bruh. <laughs> but it's just to spend on fashion. It says... Um, uh, the the money would be delivered... Uh, tarjeta Monedero. So yeah, kind of a gift card. It kind of sounds like it. For you to spend on fashion in um, the ball. Uh, Isla Azul. Centro Comercial Isla Azul. I don't think it applies for the entire mall. It seems like it just applies for like clothes in the in that place. I was still taken to spend on more pajamas. Get yourself those expensive pajamas. Easy sell the clothes later. <laughs> but yeah, this is just for the um for the mall. I thought you actually got money. Eh. That's kinda... It's kinda underwhelming. So yeah, first person gets 1,000 euros, second gets 500, third gets 250. And there's also like subcategories. It's like the... the biggest uh, snore, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, wait, is snore a word? Snore. Yeah, the biggest snorer... Um, gets an extra 250 euros. And then... What are the other categories? The most original sleeping position can get 250. Obviously, if you got the best fit, the best outfit, you can get 250. And if you're also the public's favorite, you can get 250. There's those, um, four categories. Uh, subcategories, I guess. So if you win first and you also win like any of these, you get like an extra 250. When God additions only give a gift card I'm out, just give me the money. <laughs> yeah, I just read it when it mentions the prices and yeah, seems like it's just for your fashion. I guess I could sell the fashion afterward to get the money instead. Hmm. I wonder if someone has just came and dripped out, took the 250 euros and didn't bother napping. I'm pretty sure you have to participate. 500 for dressing well and being charismatic, man. <laughs> yeah, you get like an extra 250. If you, if the, you know, the audience likes you, if you're the audience's favorite, you could get an additional 250. But yeah, very, uh, very interesting. But yeah, these are like general prices. I think the general prices are in cash. The main prize, I think that's a gift that's the gift card. Because there's like general prices, which are the ones where the categories. And there's the the big price. Who forms this competition? I'm not sure. <laughs> It's, I don't know if it's the mall. I think it might be the mall. Uh, Centro Comercial Isla Azul. I think it might be them. I think they're they're funding it. Unless the government actually funds this. I'm not sure. I think it's the mall. Might be the mall. Fascinating contest. It's very fascinating, yes. <laughs> I learned a lot today. <laughs> About the, the NAP contest, the National uh, Siesta Championships. A lot was learned. But it makes sense since you get a gift card for the mall. Yeah, it actually makes sense if you put it that way. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
It all adds up, you know. Oh yeah, oh yeah. The best part is that anybody from anywhere can compete. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. So even tourists can compete. That's pretty neat. That is actually pretty neat. You always learn the most interesting things in Tiaki Satsus. <laughs> we always end up talking about like random things. Like the National Siesta Championships. Oh yeah, definitely a uh, very educational. <laughs> Oh yeah, definitely an educational Tamil, what can I say? You always learn something new! Every stream. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know how we even start talking about these sorts of things. It kind of just happens. Before you know it, we're just talking about these sorts of topics. I want to see a broadcast though. I want to see if they actually narrate. Do they have videos? Come on. Spain siesta fiesta! <laughs> awesome. Spanish hopefuls take part in sleeping competition. I want to see like the narration. I think it'll be funny. Very didn't talk about the cursed dishes. Seven years ago? Did they not have a more recent thing? Can't find like a recent one. This this video is from seven years ago. Imagine being just like recorded while falling asleep on national TV. <laughs> that podium is so tiny. What is that? <laughs> it's like the tiniest podium I've ever seen. Like the, you know, first place, second, and third? It's like so tiny. It looks like it's made for animals rather than for people. Like for... I will put my dog in there. Ranger could be in there. Like what even? <laughs> Why is it so small? <laughs> Wait, let me take a picture. It's so tiny. It's so ridiculously tiny. It has the watermark from the CNN because that's the only video I could find. But it's so tiny. Can I find a picture of the podium? I need to find a picture of the podium that doesn't have the watermark. Spanless champion. It's so tiny. <laughs> like, you can see the guy struggling to, like, step on the first place because he's like, oh, I'm sorry, uh, excuse me. I, I can't fit in this tiny baby podium. <laughs> oh, God. What were they thinking? Come on, give me give me a picture of the, the first, second, and third. They only show me pictures of the people sleeping, unfortunately. Uh winners. Maybe if I see the winners. Man, they don't wanna show it on Google. <laughs> they don't wanna show it. <laughs> but I saw it on the, the CNN video. I was like, wait, what is that? Winning... They planned the whole thing while sleeping. Didn't bother to measure the body. <laughs> I don't think they did. No, it's so tiny. Okay, yeah, I can't find like a good Google image. I'm just gonna have to take the one from YouTube. No, camera, don't pan upwards. I need... I wanna see if I can get a good still frame. The the big CNN watermark is in the way, but... I wanna see if I can... I'm literally like, frame by frame. Okay, yeah, this is as best as it gets. I'm trying to prevent the camera from panning upwards. It's gonna be a very blurry picture. <laughs> Because the, the video is not like the greatest quality, but... Okay, I know. I'm gonna... Use the snipping tool for this. Okay. Let me get the image. Google has failed us, yes. Google has failed us. There weren't any good images. Surprised they do it in the middle of the busy mall. Yeah, they do it in the middle of the mall. Which, you know... You gotta make it harder. You're participating in a competition, so... 
the mall is very, you know, it's usually very busy and very noisy. So I think it adds to the difficulty. It adds to the challenge. Oh god. <laughs> it looks so blurry. Ugh. Ugh. Look at this little baby sized podium. <laughs> like the guy is just like, I don't fit in here. Ugh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's so baby sized. What is this? <laughs> Oh, bro, it's so small. It's like, I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I want first place. Literally a stepladder. It's so baby. <laughs> He's struggling to even stand on it. He is. <laughs> That's why I saw that. And I thought it was really funny. And it looks like the podium that you would use on like a pet competition. To have like, you, you know, the dogs, you know, stand on it. But it's like... It's really tidy for people. <laughs> like, maybe kids. Maybe it could work for children, but not for adults. <laughs> That's a children's podium borrowed from a local school. It's so tiny. <laughs> I just looked at that and thought it was really funny. Like, the guy is like, oh, I'm sorry, guys. Like, I can't fit in here, but I won first, please. I'm the best napper. But yeah, this was the best picture I could get because um, afterward, the, the camera just um, pans upwards and it doesn't show the podium. So this is the best podium image I could get. Maybe they plan the contest for children, but the professionals stepped in. I don't, I don't think there were any children participating, though. Seems like mostly adults, at least in the pictures shown. It's very much like adults. You see a lot of adults. You don't really see children. So I don't know if it... If it was really like meant for kids. Because it doesn't seem like it. I don't think there's an age requirement for signing in either. I'm trying to see if there's... Um, it's too dangerous for kids to participate in. I'm trying to see. I don't think so, no. I don't think there's like a, an age limit to participate. Doesn't seem like it. I think you have to be an adult to participate. Uh, I, I can't find the official website. So I'm going off this really ugly website. But I think... Yeah, it kind of sounds like you have to be an adult. Uh, blah, 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 sort of, uh, I can't really find any requirements on like age. So I don't. Oh, wait, I found it. It says, uh, is this the, the contest is open? Uh, anyone can participate. Uh, in case of minors, these will have to participate in team with um, an adult. So yeah. It, you could sign in as a minor, but you need to have an adult with you. You have to participate in like T in a quote unquote team. So yeah, uh, you have to have an adult participate with you. They got teams, uh, not under normal circumstances, only if you're a minor. Which you know, I think it's kind of cheating, cause like. Team napping? What's next? <laughs> they got the team napping. I feel like having team napping is kind of cheating. Like, do your points just add up? I call that cheating. But yeah, if you're a minor, you participate in teams. With, you know, an adult. The more you know. A lot of, a lot of knowledge. Synchronized napping. <laughs> It's synchronized napping. The more you know. You truly learn a lot. That should be a different category. Yeah... I I haven't really seen any videos that where they actually have like... Kids participate? Like with adults to see what the teams actually look like? Let me see. There, there's a section for... I lied. I was gonna say there's a section for videos, but then the website crashed. So I don't think there's a section for video. <laughs> it crashed. 
Man, their ugly website just... <laughs> the not only is their website ugly, it's barely functional! Uh, I, I can't even check their, their video section. Zero out of ten. The world of competitive napping is as deep as the world of garbage trucks. <laughs> Why specifically garbage trucks? This is very... Man, this is very sad. I can't look at the videos. Maybe pictures? Can you show me pictures? No. Wait, does this podium actually look bigger though? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. They have this podium on their website. Where did it say? Desktop? Yes. Does this podium look slightly bigger? Kind of looks a little bit bigger. Or... Maybe it's the picture. It looks wider. Yeah, it looks wider. That podium looks like a CG render. <laughs> yeah, this one's on their website. The podium wasn't as the render. Yeah, the this one is from their website. The table though, that is 100 percent a render. Yeah, the table does look a bit. Hmm. Very uh suspicious. Yeah, I think they just made this afterwards, after people saw this. <laughs> well, can we get a podium? We have a podium at home. Kind of vibes here. <laughs> Maybe after people found out they were using this tiny podium, they were like, Ooh, we can't, we can't uh, show this. We gotta, we gotta make it look better on the website. They didn't want to put the actual podium since it was so small. <laughs> We can't, we can't show that. People can't know that we use the kids' podium from the school down the street. Probably the AutoCAD file. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I, I looked at this and I was like, mm, I'm not 100% sure. I'm trying to see if I can find any... Anything. Wait, you can get you can get uh, prizes for taking pictures. It says there's a photography contest, like a, a siesta photography contest, and you can win up to a thousand euros. <laughs> Man, <laughs> that is that is interesting. <laughs> Let's go. Where do I sign up? <laughs> See, uh. Just their Facebook or their tw 20. What's a 20? I don't know what a 20 is. Not like 20. 20. T U E N T I. 20. <laughs> Not like 20. Just 20. <laughs> I don't know what 20 is, but apparently you can look at their profiles over there. Very old social media. I thought it was dead already. I mean, this website looks like it's... Um... This website looks old, so... I think that as you will. It's a Spanish social media, I think. Oh, I see. But yeah, you can look at their profiles through Facebook or 20. Yeah. Uh... It says 9 prices, more than 50 euros... And these will be um, given to the pictures that are classified on fourth, from fourth to twelfth place. Like a MySpace of like a MySpace of Spain. Oh, interesting. I don't know, but that sounds like a white box is twenty in broken English. <laughs> oh man. I wanted to see... I wanted to see if they had any pictures of, like, other contestants. I wanted to see what the team... The team siestas look like. But does one to th first to third not get any rewards? It's kind of weird because it sounds like... 
uh, will give prizes from the to the photos that are classified from fourth to twelfth place. So I'm like, why not like from first to twelve instead of, like from fourth to twelve? It's it's weird. It's really weird. I don't know why they mentioned from like fourth place to twelfth. It's peculiar. How choices were made. Oh, this this thing hasn't been updated since 2010. Oh no. Oh, that explains a lot of things actually. <laughs> Our website has not been updated since 2010. Hmm. That says something. Interesting. <laughs> oh my, yeah. <laughs> That explains 20. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, I, I, I just checked because I checked on their news section and last news were in 2010. So yeah, they haven't been updating anything. Yeah, everything I saw on it was really old, so I wonder if they even do it still. Yeah, I wonder. I wonder if they still do this national siesta championships. That would explain why the videos don't work. Yeah. And I was having trouble finding, like, recent information. So that would explain a lot of things for sure. Mm -hmm. But yeah, very, very interesting. But it is time. It is time. Are you ready? Are you ready for the sad? <laughs> Pray they do, we can't lose such a wonderful sport. <laughs> I find I find it hard to consider that a sport to be fair. <laughs> I'm ready to cry. It'll be fine. I think you guys will be fine. Ready for the feels. You guys are ready for the feels. Are you ready? Tess is also a sport, but I mean I can it, it's complicated. <laughs> I I mean chess kind of makes more sense than napping. I don't know. It's I I find it hard to consider napping a sport. <laughs> like I can kind of see chess, but napping. I don't know about that, chief. Chess requires a lot more than napping does. Exactly. Exactly. Precisely that. If not being a sport, then literally everything can be counted as a sport. Mm hmm. You do need skill to sleep only 20 minutes. <laughs> Maybe. I. Mm, I don't know. That's, that's a debate for another day. <laughs> but now, just gaming time. It is time. Are you ready? Are you ready for for the sad game? <laughs> is the audio is the audio going through? No. The <laughs> cute pixel eyes. Yeah, Hidali made these. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know if they're still in chat, but yeah, Hidal Hidali was the one that made these uh, pixel arts. Yeah, they were they were super cute, so I wanted to have them in the co in the corner. Okay, it's time. Oh. oh, it is time. Dun 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 dun. Da da da. Tan gao. I observe the omnipotent god that observes. Oh, someone's here. Oh, someone crashed. 
Oh, that's not... That's not good. Where were you looking, Neil? Well, excuse me for heroically... Heroically evading that squirrel out of nowhere. I, I don't... I think you killed it. He ran over it anyways. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's dead. You killed it. He ran over it and hit a tree. Look, don't worry. It's a company car. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> we don't have to pay for it. It's a company car. Don't worry about it. <laughs> My god, just do it. Are you kidding me? The boss is going to kill us! Hmm... Well, we'll just say I was saving a puppy. Oh boy. <laughs> he likes puppies, right? He's more of a cat person. Why does the world have to be so complicated? <laughs> this dude... <laughs> Oh my god. If the company didn't want me to ruin the car, then why is the tree so company car shape? <laughs> oh my god. Fine, whatever furball he fancies. Crisis averted. Can't change the puppy for a cat, this guy. <laughs> Good, go write that on your report later. Let's grab the equipment from the car and move out and move already. Okay. Oh, might as well get the equipment. Receive equipment. Got the sucker. Let's roll. Okay. I guess we can go either way. Hey, wait. Don't forget the car. Just wanted to see if you'll remember. <laughs> why, why, are, why, do, why do we care about the car? It's literally... It has smoke coming out from it. <laughs> how... How thoughtful of you. <laughs> this guy... Why is it still working? I'm surprised the car is still working, to be fair. <laughs> oh, there's a rock on the lid. We'll put a boulder here. Maybe it's their security system. Cucumbers, we don't have time for this fluff. Let's try pushing it out of the way. Maybe we could find a tree branch to jack it with. Wait! Or we could just call it a night and blame it on that. He really doesn't want to do his job. <laughs> My guy, he really, he really doesn't want to do his job, does he? At least he's on. <laughs> oh, at least he's honest. But geez, you could at least be a little bit more subtle. <laughs> to be fair, who wants to? <laughs> he's just like me, for real, for real. <laughs> Push it by hand. Find a branch. About a board mission to go. Wait, I can actually do this. Is this like an actual twist? I want to see what happens if I pick this though. I know probably the right thing is to find a branch to push it. Yeah, I want to. I want to see. You do know that you won't be paid if we don't go through with it, right? Hmm. I do need to fund an IKEA shopping spree soon. <laughs> Okay, yeah. It, okay. Alright, on three. One, two, three! Oh. What kind of boulder is this? Ay. Your choices matter. <laughs> I mean, this game never mentioned that they did. It bows, it did. Where are these sprites on the left? Character sprites were made as you. Yeah, these were made by Hirali. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're... They're sprites to match the, the style of the game. Yep. I... I don't even... What was that? Not a boulder, that's for sure. It balanced. Uh, we need to get going for now. We'll... We'll figure that thing out later. Right. Oh, let's get out of here. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Oh, squirrels! Da, 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 da. Okay, we have arrived to the house. Here we are. Hello. Knock knock. We have arrived. Bada, bada, baba, baba, baba. Ma, they're here. 
Oh. Here we are. Not a bad place to retire at, huh? Why is he looking to the side like that? I could do better. <laughs> this dude... <laughs> I mean, do you have that much retirement money, Dr. Watts? Do you have that much retirement money to get a house bigger than this? Hmm? This dude. Night shifts, love him or hate him? You know the answer, you stupid owl. This guy, man, this guy. It's probably gonna be around another all-nighter, you know? Bro could do better than a seaside mansion, sheesh! Yeah, apparently. He's missing a couple of exotic animals. <laughs> oh my god. I know. And I don't do have any coffee. Shut up! And the ocean waves will sing lullabies. Not through your blathering, they won't. And your eyelids will... <laughs> Ignored. Don't forget the equipment, moron. He forgot it. Get ready for gore. I don't get paid enough for this. <laughs> How much does he get paid? He literally just said he could afford a better mansion than this. Act 1. I never told anyone, but I've always thought they were lighthouses. Clearly not enough. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Dr. Watson, Dr. Rosaline, I presume? Uh, thanks for coming on such a short notice. That's okay. I tend to be pretty bad at predicting deaths as well. <laughs> this dude! Oh my god. I don't think that's something you should say. <laughs> <laughs> My god. Are you the patient's daughter? What's well, just literally no filter. <laughs> he has literally no filter whatsoever. Oh, no. Um, this is her his caretaker. Like, zero filter. This man has zero filter. What even? I love it. <laughs> oh, god. And these are my children, Sarah and Tommy. It's not exactly a 9-to-5 job, so Johnny let us live here. I suppose this Johnny is our man. Johnny? Listen, if it's a kid we're dealing with, I don't think we're the ones you want. I don't think you want Dr. Watts on this one. Watts just lets his intrusive thoughts wait on the time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, no, no. He just prefers to be called that. He's upstairs right now with his medical doctor. Come with me. Oh, okay. Come on, grab that case and let's go. When my back breaks one day, I'll sue you with the insurance claim. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> I mean, how heavy is it? All right, let's head upstairs before I drop this. This dude. <laughs> oh my god, go upstairs. Yeah, sure. Let's go upstairs. Okay, they're gone. Whoever gets there first gets to play the melody. Oh, there are the kids. The box is half his height. Of course it's heavy. <laughs> hi, hi, Peter. Welcome, welcome. No fair! You push me! Did not! Whatever! You get the boring two notes anyway. Dun 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 Oh. Dun, 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 dun. It's a nice melody. Those kids are pretty good for their age. Hey, you're the one who said there was no time to waste. And 
incidentally, I'm the one who is carrying the weight of a small meteorite. Yeah, yeah, come on. It's a sad game, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay. Here we are. Uh, do we talk to you? He's unresponsive at this point, but by the looks of things, he's still consciously hanging on. It's hard to say how long you'll have, but I would hurry. Okay. Ready to set up? Gee, you know, I think I'd like to carry this excruciatingly heavy object around some more. Thanks for asking, though. <laughs> I'm sorry, I want to look around. <laughs> oh, okay, this is just a bathroom. I just wanted to see you to check around the room first. Wait, that kind of looks like Squidward. Like that Squidward painting. A painting of an animal of some sort. Watts is so sassy. He is very sassy. Bold and brass. <laughs> he does! <laughs> What can I say? He's a very sassy man. Oh. YouTube studio? The YouTube studio died. I think he... I think he died. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. Wait. I'm trying to... Restore YouTube... YouTube studio. Oh, no. That's not good. YouTube studio. It has been very finicky today for some reason. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Okay, there you go. I managed to fix it. Yes, it'll just be a moment. I live. Yes, I live. But, um... Are you sure a common household power outlet is sufficient? No worries, we are the experts. <laughs> oh no, that doesn't sound good. Oh. Standard procedures, just keeping you on your toes. You didn't sound very sure about that one though. <laughs> Oh no, I thought the power was gonna go out for a second. This guy's like, yeah, it's just normal. Don't worry about it. How's he doing? Not so well. If I were to say, he's got just a day or two left. That's plenty of time. A day or two? I don't think that's a lot of time. So you two can grant him any wish, huh? We try, at least. But we always succeed because we're awesome! <laughs> this guy. That was the most... I don't know what's going on, but I'm just gonna pretend answer. <laughs> so, what's the wish? The moon. The moon? The moon. He wants to go to the moon. The geezers just keep on getting crazier, huh? So, uh, can you do it? It depends. She meant to say yes. She <laughs> this dude. <laughs> yeah, she, she meant to say yes. Why don't you tell us about our client here? That... I don't really know much. The title job. We got title job. He's like, uh... Yeah, totally. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh god, he's the type that lies just to... Make the client happy. Johnny's an odd man. Through the two years that I've worked here, he rarely spoke. He worked as a craftsman for most of his life, and his wife passed away two years ago. I don't really know many details. I would have known more if I were his paper boy for Pete's sake. Jesus, what? <laughs> oh my god, this guy, this guy literally has zero filter. <laughs> He's like, you work here for two years and that's all you know? What do you mean? <laughs> oh my god, what? Please. Shush, just do your thing. 
Well, I suppose if you look around the house, you may find some more information. I suppose Johnny wouldn't mind since he signed for you two. Hmm. So be it. Alright, which one of us plays detective? Oh, we can choose. So we can choose who we want to control. Rosalyn or Watts? I think Watts will probably have funnier dialogue, so I want to go for Watts. <laughs> I think Watts will probably say funny things if we explore the house with Watts. So... I think. Watts for the funny. Yeah, I think Watts will be funnier. I'll do it. I once played Sherlock Holmes in a high school musical. I remember you playing Watson. Nah, same thing. Just configure this. I got it started anyway. Of course, Yagi goes for this sassy guy. He's gonna have a more interesting dialogue. My children can show you around. They're probably downstairs at the piano. Okay. Wait, no, no. This way, this way, this way. Gotta go down the stairs. Wait, come back here for a moment. I have something for you. Oh, what's up? Watson. <laughs> I see what they did there. Do you find anything yet, Sherlock? What do you mean? You literally told me you had something for me. Probably don't search the piano. I was trying to leave, but she literally said she had something for me. What do you, what do you want? She literally just interrupted me before I could go downstairs. What? I have something. Oh, this doctor. <laughs> I look at the wrong on the wrong person. <laughs> Here. Here. Take this. Remote patient monitor. That'll keep you updated on Johnny's status. I hope there's no self destruct button. I seem to have a knack for those. Johnny's heart monitor is now activated in the menu. Oh god, I have his heart. Oh, I guess I can see his heart monitor now. Okay, there you go. Okay. Hi there. Can't self-destruct the patient. I thought these kids were gonna show me around. Come here. Hmm, I guess they're busy. Okay. Guess they're not gonna show me around. I thought they were actually gonna show me around, but they're... Mm. Turn on and store tap water. Sure. Oh, there's a shiny in here. Oh, it's just a lamp. Okay, guess the kids are not gonna actually show me around. Probably better to ask those kids. I tried! Okay, fine. It doesn't allow me to ask them though. There you go. What do you want? Hey! Oh. Hey, your mom told me to sh told you to show me around the house. I had to use my arrow keys actually for this. Okay, maybe we will. M maybe I think we just need a little convincing, that's all. What do you think, Tommy? Yeah. Uh-oh. Alright, let's talk. What do you punks want? We want one trillion dollars. Or the candy cane mom hides from us. Yeah, or that. Uh, what? There is a dying candy cane on top of a high shelf that we can't reach. It's in the kitchen. Ma put it there to save for when we do chores. Get it for us and we'll give you a tour through the house. What do you say? Well... Nah, help me. Wanting to eat stash candy is a serious crime, you know. <laughs> I heard you can get six years for that. <laughs> I just lied too bad. <laughs> I mean, they started it, so... You you thought you were scheming against me. nuh -uh. Oh no, what do we do, sis? We're sorry, we didn't know. <laughs> uh, they can out-scheme me. Uh-huh. Well, if you show me around this place now, I'll keep my mouth shut. Really? You would do that for us? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm actually getting away with it. Sure, I'm feeling nice today. Ew, thanks. Yeah, we'll help. 
Big brain, five brain. <laughs> bamboozle the children. They try to bamboozle me, so I bamboozle them. Alright, where do we start? I know, there's this funny room in the basement. I don't like that funny room. Uh, what kind of funny room? You'll see. It's weird. Tiagi hitting them with the Uno reverse card. <laughs> we need to get the keys though. The old man hid it inside a book in the study. Okay, book in the study. Oh, are you one of these? No, not these books. Hmm, okay, that's a bathroom. Is it maybe here? This is the book room! The key to the funny room is in the thickest book in the upper shelf. Okay, one of these then. Oh yeah, I might just use the arrow keys. Using the mouse is... <laughs> Dusklight, the tale of a girl who fell in love with a zombie who emitted the smell of daisies when showered with <laughs> sunlight. Oh, this is a Twilight reference. Read passage. Oh, maybe next time. Receive a room key. A man sure knows where to hide things. Yeah, <laughs> that was a Twilight reference. Oh, I can turn these on. Okay, we got the key. We can open the funny room in the basement now! Oh, guess we're opening the, the funny room in the basement. This is the basement. We play hide and seek here. Turn on the light before you trip over something. Okay. Oh, I'm sure you mean this room. The door is locked. There you go. What's in here? It's like a cave in here. Oh! Oh my god. Uh, I don't know if I like this room very much. <laughs> a stuffed toy platypus. What a hideous little creature. <laughs> Hold it. Take it. Receive toy platypus. I don't like this room. I thought this was supposed to be a funny room. It's not a funny room. <laughs> do you see it? What do you kids know about all those rabbits? Nothing. The old man didn't want anyone to go inside, so we never told him. There's more of them, actually. Where? Inside the abandoned lighthouse. It's just beneath this cliff. Wanna go see? I got the keys! Let me guess, you aren't supposed to go in there either. <laughs> Remind me to never keep any locked cabinets around you two. So, you wanna go see the lighthouse? Well, it's rather windy outside, but... Yeah. Oh, to heck with it. I'm Dr. Watts and your wind can't stop me. Come on, let's go kick some butts. I mean, we gotta do it anyway, so might as well. <laughs> Famous last words. Famous last words be before disaster. Uh, let's see. What's over here, actually? Dong, dong. Oh! There's the lighthouse. There it is! We need to head south to the street and take the other path to get down to it, though. Yeah, I forgot my parachute. You had a parachute? How did these kids get a parachute? Interesting. <laughs> Just casually having a parachute. No, no big deal. Why do they need a parachute? I mean, it's kind of far. <laughs> it is kind of far, so... It, the house is kind of like in a cliff, so... I can see why they would need a parachute. Dun, dun, dun. It's here! Huh? My novelty beach ball! I thought I lost it! Oh! It's stupid anyway. Oh, I'll never lose it again! I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide it, don't look! 
Uh, we don't have time for it. Okay, done. Right. Now let's just head to the lighthouse. Yeah, it was a, it was a beach ball apparently. <laughs> it's smoking. Who's that dummy that crashed the car? <laughs> oh no. That was uh Dr. Rosaline, yeah. Oh, Dr. Rosaline. Tis tis tis. Bruh, he didn't want to admit that he was the one that crashed the car. <laughs> This dude. <laughs> oh, a squirrel! Hey there. Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> Don't worry, kids. I got this! <laughs> Wait, what? He actually has a fight! Oh, uh... Shoe? Other shoe. I want a tsunami kid. Yelling volume, the loudest. This ends here. Hiya! Stop it! A will tell Ma you animal abuse. Oh. Yeah, she called the cops on you. Oh, come on. I wasn't actually gonna. Don't you like role playing? You should be ashamed of yourself. Let's name it Teddy. Okay. Let's just go. My whole night is ruined. No tsunami kick. No tsunami kick. <laughs> the kids being more mature. <laughs> uh, I wasn't expecting combat. I think it was just like a little segment, yeah. Poor Wad's getting bullied by kids. <laughs> no tsunami kick, no. Bum, bum. Yeah, I wasn't expecting an actual, like, RPG segment for a second. Okay, here we are. This is the lighthouse. Wait, what's that over there? Oh, this? In memory of River E. Wiles. Shoe, other shoe was my favorite part. Just like shoe, the other shoe. River Wiles, huh? Was she Dawn's wife? Oh no! Come on! The lighthouse right there! Okay, fine. Looks very ominous. A river. I'm assuming she's gonna like... Come up in the story later. Sheesh! Don't they have elevators? <laughs> this guy. <laughs> this is it! A lot of bunnies. Oh, there's this one. A multicolored paper rabbit. Hey, this wasn't here when we came last week. Oh yeah, Johnny must have come here before he fell ill again. Two colors, huh? Am I the only one who's a little creeped out by these, though? Yeah, you are. Yep! What the? Someone's calling me. Interesting ringtone. Ugh, I should have guessed. Yeah, yeah, we're coming. Blah, blah, blah. Alright, let's head back. As for this. Yep, we took the origami rabbit. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, I've returned from my journey. What the cactus were you doing? Burning ants with a magnifying glass. Using moonlight. Okay, I was taking a nap then. God, it's so hard to be smart nowadays. You're pretty good at being half of it. Psh. Your helmet's on the couch. Get it on and we're going. Okay, fine. This guy, initiate. Ready or not, here it goes. This dude. <laughs> He's quite the character. I'll, I'll say that. Ooh. He 
he's great. <laughs> I mean, he's the comedy relief. Oh, so we're gonna go backwards. This should be the last accessible memory. Disable speech for all except Johnny. Done? Let's get him! At any time, you can view your position in time by moving the mouse towards the top of the screen. Oh, yeah. Right now, we're, we're still in his... Old man years. Okay. So, how to check... Wait, let's get out of here. Ba, ba, ba. Where is he? Is he at the lighthouse? I wonder if he's at the lighthouse. Oh, wait, they did mention that... He was over there at the lighthouse, though. You see, he made that, uh, paper... paper origami rabbit. So he's probably there. Oh, oh we can't leave. Oh, maybe we see him this way, then. I was thinking of going to the lighthouse, but no. Oh! He's there! Found him. Johnny? Oh, what a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. Oh wait, he can talk to us. My name is Dr. Eva Rosaline, and this is... Dr. Von Matterhorn. Dr. Lorenzo Von Matterhorn. Dr. Neil Watts. Are you familiar with the Sigma Agency of Life Generation? He was trying to get a cool name. <laughs> oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Lily? Actually, you've already called us. Yep, she's gone. We're here to fulfill our contract from the relative future. Careful there, if you slip off the cliff, we're gonna have to reload this memory. Watch it, Neil. Show some respect. It's gonna be freaky. Yeah, it's gonna be really scary. Eh, it's just a program, you know. I know, but this is his last accessible memory and we need its cooperation. Worst comes to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you waste time like that? You. That's gonna be so freaky. Imagine getting people and it turns out they come from the future. Oh yeah, for sure. It's just like, huh? And they just make like people from your memories just vanish like that. Imagine being told you're dying and that this was just a memory. Super freaky. <laughs> yeah. Super scary, ma'am. You're here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Yes, John. I suppose I had a good run. Not good enough, it seems. Oh my god, what? Stop it! <laughs> Not good enough, shush! So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? We can't, but you might be able to. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. It's fine, you can tell us. It's essential for helping us to get you there. Do you want the fame? The money? You've got to have a motive. What really does always let the intrusive thoughts live? <laughs> intrusive thoughts all the time. That's pretty much how he is all the time. I'm sorry, but I don't really know. I just... do. I can already tell that this is gonna be a pain in the butt. Nevertheless, Johnny. Here's what we will do. We need to get to your childhood, but it is too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to traverse through your memories with gradual backward leaps. Which you have given us permission to do in the relative future. 
Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for direct access, we'll return here. That's when you'll need to help us influence the childhood you to become an astronaut. Or to get on a giant catapult. I, I think the giant catapult is not a good idea. <laughs> the point is, you'll need to have more to say than just I don't know. As long as you can take me to the moon, I'll cooperate in any way possible. Good. But it's possible, is it really? I'm pretty sure it isn't possible with a giant catapult. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the... The stratosphere will probably burn you. Now, in order to leap to a memory... We need an item that is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? Oh, does he? He didn't say he didn't make it there alive! <laughs> oh my god. That'll do. Well, shall we? Ladies first. Okay. Note, Moon. We'll need to prepare this memento first. Prepare. Ooh. Complete the memento. Click the orbs to flip the pieces. Oh, interesting. Da 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 da. A memento can now be activated from traversal. Activate memento, yes. Wait, what about my privacy? A little bit too late to ask about that. You already signed the contract. We'll try not to violate what we can avoid. But in most cases, it can't be helped. A little too late to be asking about the privacy. <laughs> you should have thought about that when you signed the contract. He didn't read the small print. Shaking my head. Shaking my head. Oh my god, he has a bunch of them all over the house. Turn off visibility and interactivity. It'll be messy to be seen. Yeah, yeah, happy. Oh jeez, that's a lot of them. Jeez, I forgot to ask him about all of these. Rabbits. This is creeping me out. We probably should have checked his record for psychopathy first. Oh. What the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. It's probably just a part of his memory. Oh. Oh my, he got Ingi. Then I stand by my point. Anyway, quit blabbering and find a memento from here to hop from. This man. I think it's... We could probably use the same one we used before, right? This one. Well, aren't you special? Having two colors when all your siblings look like they drown in bleach. What's that? You think you're really creepy? Why, yes, I agree. <laughs> Why is he <it> so mean? <laughs> My god, he always chooses intrusive thoughts over everything. Mm, anything? Oh, maybe this. The clock is moving but soundless. Receive a note clock. Oh, we got something from here. Uh... Yeah, nothing else in here. We can check all their rooms. Watch, Chili has a way with words. Ah, yes, he truly does. Doesn't he? <laughs> uh, is there anything? Oh, maybe this? The Emperor's New Clothes by Hans Christian Andersen. Okay, that apparently was relevant. Bookshelf. Selection of readings from medical journals. Nope. Nothing in the bookshelf. Oh, can we talk to him? Oh. Backpack! An old and patched up backpack. What is this? A million years old? I guess we'll find out. Oh, can we check? No, we cannot. Watts truly has a way with words. He truly does, doesn't he? <laughs> a glass bottle of pickle olives. Heh, I hate this stuff. What's to hate? It's pickle olive. Exactly. 
I don't I don't like pickle olives either. I kinda agree with Watts on this one. Okay, we already talked about uh, maybe do we need to interact with him again? So he resets the items. Fresh wildflowers! Oh, never mind. We got all of them. Now we just need to find the memento. Don't. If we have to explain our presence to him at every memory, I'll go crazy. Don't tempt me. Yeah, oh, the umbrella. The umbrella is the memento. Okay. We can use the umbrella to travel. Oh, there you go. Memento discovered. Ba bum, ba bum, ba bum. Ah, Dwarkin! <laughs> what the? What was that? What? That's it. I'm doing the breaking from now on. No, the Hadouken! <laughs> He's so silly. Uh, missing the bee opportunity. Yeah, I didn't do the didn't do the bee. <laughs> and then just this. There you go. The references in here are wild, honestly, for such an old game. For sure, yeah. Okay, activate my month. Oh, yes. What's the pause? Thank you so much for being Welcome a member to Nylena. of Nylena for five months. Thank you, thank you. Oh, hello. When it comes to rain, through is better than onto. I don't mind it regardless. Seems like these memory hops only span a short period of time. Also, hi, hi, pods. Welcome, welcome. We need to find a leaping memento or it's going to take forever. Meh, just enjoy the scenery. I mean, it's really, it looks really nice. Like, I know some people don't like rainy sceneries because they think they're kind of depressing, but I don't know, I think they're kind of chill. I don't know, I kind of like it when it's like, when it's not stormy, kind of just like raining. I think it's kind of nice. In memory of River E. Wiles. Old stuff, toy platypus. Honestly, I just don't think this animal has the right to exist. What what did platypus what did the platypus did to you? The world's not big enough for two of you. Why does he hate plat uh, the platypus so much? I like rain, except if it rains too much where I live so it loops back around to not liking it. I like rain when it's not a storm. Yeah. It was really like a red dot. I like watching rain. Like, when it's not like a storm storm. Uh, I already talked to him, so we're missing more. Oh, we can go inside the lighthouse, probably. It's finished, River. Maybe he's related with certain platypus-hating doctor Doofenshmitz. I like listening to the rain when I'm in a warm place. I don't like the rainy scenery when I have to ride through it on my motorcycle for two hours. Yeah, I mean, obviously if you're outside, it's probably not as good. <laughs> but I don't know. I, 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 just, I just find it relaxing. Like you, I'll be able to watch over her every day. She won't be alone anymore. Oh, is he talking about the platypus? I might never understand why, but I stay true to your wish. I'm sure Anya is grateful to you. But when I'm gone... Who is going to watch over us? It do be relaxing, yeah! Who are you? My name is Eva. I was just passing by. Was she your wife? Yes, her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. Hmm? She... she didn't need to do it. But she... But she? You wouldn't understand. I don't even understand. 
Well, I guess we just vanish in front of his eyes, just like that. He's like, you wouldn't understand. Okay, bye. <laughs> like, okay. That's that's a that's a little bit mean. He's he's being all sad and you're just like, adios. <laughs> just disappear in front of his eyes. Receive note, Anya. Wait, where did where did Watts go? I thought he went to the lighthouse with us. Maybe he's at the top already. What? About time you got here. I almost thought you fell off the cliff. What were you doing? Just pieces out while talking. <laughs> she literally just pieced out while he was talking. Enjoying the scenery. What else? Any luck here? Big luck. Huge. Dinosauric. Huh, this place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse. What do you expect? Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun rebreaking the barrier for yourself. Bro! It's probably this. A broken lighthouse lamp. Oh! I guess he left us? Okay, there you go. We're really missing those two, so... Bro, he broke the barrier and just left me! <laughs> okay, at least we found the last two orbs pretty easily. But man... Okay... Ideal shows the minimum of moves that Memento can be completed in. Oh. Yeah. There you go. Three moves, baby! <laughs> okay, activate. There you go. Did it in exactly three moves. The ideal. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Just enough. Bum, bum, bum. After we pay for your operation, we will just have enough left for it, so don't worry. Quite lie. That's what you call it, right? N no, I'm sure we can just... Stop it. I don't like it when you lie. I calculated our finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try to convince me against my will? We need the money for your medical bills, River! I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this... This is just too much. I mean, she... She isn't even... Do you know what makes me happy, dummy? What? Do you? Well, I do. I just... Hope you can help me with it. River? When the papers for my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you would grant me my wish, I want you to use it to finish building the house. And then, for every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. Visit her, speak to her, comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. And what about you? Happy. I'll be happy. Johnny? Yes? I made this. Tell me, what is it? What? Just tell me what it is. It's a rabbit, like all the others you made. What else? 
Um, it's made of paper. What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? He's running out of things to say. Uh, look, River. I wrote a song. It's for you. Okay. Well, would you like to hear it? Yes. You didn't have to bring the piano in here for this. I can hear you just fine with the door open. He, he wanted to bring the, 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 the music straight to you, though. It's called For River. Just swept the conversation aside because he couldn't think anything else. He's like, ah, uh, uh, what else do I say about this thing? <laughs> Why so cliche? It's, uh, just a placeholder. Oh, it's this song. Dun, 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 dun. Who is this Anya that we're talking about? If she's so important, shouldn't we have seen her in his late memories? I guess he didn't keep that promise after all. Unless... Unless... what? Never mind. Hey, that's the same song the kids were playing earlier, huh? I guess he taught them. You know what? I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on. I already got my memory links. You wanna ha hitch a quick ride or look around yourself? I kind of want to look around, though. Bruh, he uses a too manly for this. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? I kind of wanna, I kind of wanna look around. I wanna see if we can find anything else. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. He's toxic masculinity. Yeah. Oh, he's not even that manly. <laughs> Don't you miss the days when memory audio to MPA conversion was legal? What is this? I think I brought home over 2,000 songs during my first year on this job. He's, a, he's an interesting fellow. Okay, let's see... Receive note, Paper Rabbit. Okay, that's one. The book is probably another one. The Emperor's New Clothes. Bro could barely handle walking up five flights of stairs. Yeah, he's a... Uh, he's quite the character, isn't he? There's, oh, probably in the next room. I already found where the memento is. Just need to find the orbs. Uh, nothing here, so downstairs. This dude, man. Oh! There. Pot of mixed dough. Glass bottle of pickled olives. Someone really likes these. Uh, I need to talk to them. I'm telling you, there's just no way! But what if we take it apart? Look at us, John. We aren't exactly at the ripe age of piano moving. You know what? If this means that much to you, I'll pay for the professionals to do this. I can't help saving that house for you, so this is the least I can do. Oh wait, was the house gonna get demolished? What do you mean saving the house? Were they actually getting rid of the house? Oh no. That's no good. Okay, I got the... I got the orbs. Da -dum, da -dum. Okay, memento, prepare. Da -da 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 -da. Ideal for moves. Hmm. S2. 
Oh, that did not work out as I thought. <laughs> Wait, no! I it did not it did not actually work as a vision. Can I reset it? <laughs> I wanted to reset it. I messed it up. <laughs> Mistakes are made. Mistakes were indeed made. It did not work out. No reset button is evil. Yeah, I need a reset button. Oh god. Yeah, I'm stuck in a very awkward spot. I need I need a reset button. What nope, that doesn't do anything. Can I Nope, I can't leave. Okay. That's not good. That is so bad. I already wasted so many moves because I I'm in a very bad spot. Well I finished it, but at what cost? 19 moves. <laughs> I was so bad, but oh well. Okay, well, I'm getting out of here. <laughs> oh god, I wanted to reset because I messed up. Nineteen, slightly higher than optimal. Yeah. Finally. Easy. <laughs> Uh, slightly. Just only slightly. Oh, this is when the house was barely being built. Hey, look what we have here. Yeah, this is when they were building a house. That is such a big house for two people, though. Like, it just makes me wonder, why did she want the house to be that big? I bet they saw this cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. That is true. It's not a house, it's a mansion. <laughs> I mean, that that is straight up a mansion, yeah. Oh. What's this? Nick called and said I should come. I brought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just a di her illness was just diagnosed in its late stage. Ordinately is treatable. But the medical bills. I mean, I, I don't think you can pay for those bills with the big mansion. We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved that she'll be okay, but... You don't know how much this place means to her. She's going to be heartbroken. I would help, but Tad and I have been barely getting by since the market crashed. What are you going to do now? I am... I'm going to tell her that we can make it. I'm going to tell her that we can afford everything. I don't want her to do anything crazy. You shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she will choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when you... N neuro... Okay. Think you know what's best for others. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? 
I'm going to pick something from this cliff to bring back to her. It will at least give her some comfort. That doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. Oh. A music box? What is this? He said it's called Everything is Alright. It's the song! It isn't. What an awful situation to be stuck in. Having to pick between the life and happiness slash dreams of the person you love. Yeah, between life and happiness or the dreams of the person you love. Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's quite the situation, yeah. That's the memento. Uh, is there anything? Maybe inside the house? Oh, there was one in there. Uh, nothing else in here. Maybe I need to follow him. Uh, I don't see anything useful here, so I think we might just have to go after him. Oh, there's two just for following him. Okay. Yeah, we had to follow him. Oh, I can't reach him, Bo. Okay, guess we don't go that way. It's the song. I was humming this all day after you posted your version on Twitter. Yeah. This is where the song is from, from this game. We're missing one orb, but I'm not sure where it is. Is that my... Oh, it was from the car. Only certain items give them to you. It's not everything. Yeah, it was the car, apparently. What about the live performance? I, I already did a karaoke yesterday, no. Okay. Oh my god. I deal in three moves. Hmm. I'm thinking. <laughs> I'm thinking how to do it. It's in diagonal. Oh! Diagonal would work. There you go! Nice. Got it. <laughs> Three moves. Nice. Okay. Put this here. Pickle olives. Activate. We cannot be blamed if we really like it. <laughs> the perfect run. This time we did get the perfect run. I can't buy any karaoke's from yesterday! Too bad. <laughs> the people that were there, they witnessed it. They, w they would know. <laughs> so, you guys are really going for it, huh? Yup, the construction's starting in just a few months. It's a bit of a squeeze. We had to split the payment. But with financing, we'll make do. Watch the pickle olives show, show up in literally every memory. <laughs> Welcome to Nylena. Osho, hi hi. Vitas, thank you for being a member of Nylena for four months. I'm new here, sure you are. <laughs> How wonderful. Having your dream house built is such a beautiful sight. You had your wedding at that lighthouse near there all those years ago, didn't you? That's not all that special about it. We have a long history with that place. Well, it's good to have some good news that it go well together for once. Cheers and congratulations, you two. Hey, cheers. Be right back. I'm gonna get some fresh air. M me too. 
Uh oh, I don't like where this is going. She was she was not very nice on the other flashback. She's gonna say something bad to River. Well, buddy, it's sure been a while, hasn't it? Who knew how hard it is to get across a few cities nowadays? That River still so quiet, huh? Uh, she's actually been talking about home and with Isabel. I guess she's just not used to you. Haha, <laughs> so I'm the bad guy here, huh? I'm worried. Oh, hey, so did you tell River that thing from back then? I did. So, how did she take it? For the most part, she took it well. But something bugs me. Uh-oh. Ever since the incident, she's been making these strange rabbits out of paper. Origami rabbits? Yes, lots of them. Ah, I used to fold origami animals for my daughter all the time. What's wrong with that? I don't think it's the same thing. She's been doing nothing but making the same rabbits. Day in and day out. Our house is literally filled with them now. Didn't Isabel say that something like that is a common trade with River's condition? Yes, but something doesn't feel right this time. When I ask her about it, she never answers. Instead, she gets this distant look in her eyes. It's almost as if she wants something from me. And the strange thing is, I feel like there's something I owe her too. Have you asked Isabel? Yes, she says she talked to her about it, but got nothing. Ah. Well, I'm certainly not one to inquire, but I'll tell you this. I've known you since middle school, and you're notorious for overthinking. You're probably just imagining things. There's no need to get too worked up. Hmm. Usually when someone says that, something's always wrong. But I'll give you the benefit of doubt. You're probably right. Probably. I'm always right, John. Hmm. The music is very ominous, so I don't know about that. Wait, so even he himself never knew what was up with those rabbits? Forget about the stupid rabbits. We got bigger problems. It's a confined memory, and there are no mementos anywhere. Don't worry. We can probably draw one out from him. How? Leave it to me. I just gotta give the bartender a quick visit first. Oh, God. Yeah, rabbits are pretty cute. Mm hmm. Hey there, could I get you anything? Hey yo, could I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash or credit? Check. Uh, I'm sorry, we don't take we don't take checks. Oh, uh, just put it on my tab then. Wait, does that mean you don't have any money? <laughs> you are so getting resetted. Hey there, could I get you anything? Hi could I get a bottle of pickled olives, please? Sure, cash or credit. Just put it on my tab. I feel like spending big today. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, thank you, sir. Here's your pickled olives. Thanks, bro. You'll be getting an enormous amount of tips today. Thank you, sir. You're such a jerk, Neil. Oh, loosen up. Oh, my God. He just reset it. <laughs> Okay, well, we got pickled olives. Why? Is that a bottle of pickled olives you're sporting? Yeah, are you a fellow olive lover? Indeed I am. Just got a fresh bottle of them myself and fat. Mind if I join you? Sure, why don't you grab a seed? We'll down a bottle together. They just... Oh, oh, that kind of sounds nasty. Just like, just drink them like that? Ooh, I don't think I... Oh, God. I don't think I could. <laughs> I think I would like your gag if I did that. Oh, yeah. That sounds so just swell. Eva, disable tea simulation now. I think that bottle's alcohol, not olives. But they said pickle olives, though. 
Oh, Neil, I don't think I feel like it. I'm so gonna get you back for this. So, that's how we got our first toaster. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Ah, uh, uh, uh. You okay there? Yes, I'm just savoring the amazingness of pickle olives. They're wonderful, aren't they? Yeah, I just can't understand how anyone could uh, find such things to be disgusting. Take your time. We got two bottles left. Oh god, he's gonna die. So I said, hey, that's not right. And they totally agreed. Two more bottles. And you know what else is wrong with society today? Yeah, I actually have it right here. Why? May I see it? Uh, okay. Here it is. And freeze! Finally, dear lord! How are the olives, Neil? Oh, shut your mouth! Okay, we're finally free. <laughs> Wait, don't you dare. Don't worry, sheesh. See? I'm doing it by the books. Hulk smash! <laughs> Neil, seriously! I'm trying to get into this and you're ruining the mood. Totally worth it. You decided to do Hulk Smash! We live in a society who wants the real one. Truly the real one here. Hmm. So, ideal floor moves. I'm trying to think if I do this, it's gonna reset these two. Gonna cover these. Hmm. Uh, I could just try to do it in the ideal, but <laughs> uh, okay, whatever. This is fine. Oh God. There you go. Hey! Floor! There you go. Ideal. <laughs> okay, I got it. <laughs> nice. Activate memento. Yes. Wop, 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 wop. Here we are. Dun, 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 also, whoo, thank you so much for the raid! And welcome, welcome, raiders! I'm Chiaki Katsumi from Pixelings. I'm Pixelings Resident Cat Hacker. We're currently playing to the moon. Hope that you had a good stream, whoo! But what are you guys up to? Mm hmm. Not gonna lie, if this was me, I would have fallen back on the hit random button strat ages ago. <laughs> Yeah, I mean to be fair, uh, that that is like a perfect valid strat. You have thirty moves. You don't really need to do the ideal. I don't know if there's even an achievement for like reaching the ideal. Yeah, hello, hi hi readers, welcome welcome. Ranky nutcrackers, you are an Australian. Who cares? We're like 20, 20 billion nanometers off the ground and standing on a flagpole. Just jump down. It's not like you can be hurt here. Actually, the Obey increases every move, so you have more than plenty. Hmm. So yeah. Are you kidding me? It's skydive! You can't stay on here and you can't get off. God, I hate it when this happens. Oh, he's gonna get pushed. <laughs> I swear, if this play... Ava, what the... <laughs> it's like, Ava, what the... There. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I saw her standing behind him, so... 
I knew it. I called it. Yeah. When I saw her, she was moving behind him. I knew it was gonna happen. <laughs> Why would they abandon her like this? I suppose she's just no longer needed. No longer needed? By ships, I mean. You know how it is, now that everything has GPS and all that. Oh, is Anya the lighthouse? Look, River... This place means a lot to me too, and uh, I've been thinking... In our current state, things have been pretty stable. That's who Anya is? It kind of seems like it. it that, that's kind of like the implication I'm getting. If we save well in a few years, we could afford to build a house on top of here. It's going to be a squeeze, but I'm... We'll be able to see her from the window! In the morning, at night, we'll always be nearby. And... And we could walk here anytime. She'll never be alone again, John! I'll be able to watch over her every day! Yeah, we will. Yeah, because she's referring to the lighthouse as she, so I think this is Anya. Good for them. You gotta be kidding me. You remember what happens, don't you? It's like watching the train wreck. The ending isn't any more important than any of the moments leading to it. The important thing is that over here, they're happy. Let's move on. Just let them be happy, at least for a little bit. Okay, there's no mementos in here, it seems. Yeah. Okay, let's get out of here. Da 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 da. So, wait a minute. They were referring to the lighthouse as Anya, weren't they? I suppose so. Then that river, she declined treatment for the sake of a lighthouse? Isn't that a bit too extreme? I've seen stranger things in the course of the job. Me too, but ugh, I can never wrap my head around it. It's not of our business anyway. She's our client. Yeah, so Anya is the lighthouse. Well, in other words, she did decline treatment for the lighthouse. So she wanted to keep the house to look over the lighthouse. Uh, anything else here? Mm, no. Oh! Okay. We got two from these memories. I guess we gotta be finding their memories of walking around. Well, buildings also need maintenance. Yeah, but it's... You know, it's, it's still kind of surprising she picked that over, you know... Her actual... Life. It's a really cool lighthouse. Play okay, Memento. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, apparently they mentioned they had, like, important meaning for them, so... Uh, if I... We'll fill this entire line, almost, but then... Mm. Uh... If I could do this diagonal, that would be pretty neat. <laughs> Oh, no. I have five moves. Hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be... Yeah, I don't think I can do this in five. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, I already messed it up. <laughs> oh, no. Oh well. Yeah, it's Dover. It's so Dover. Yeah, Perfect Run is gone. Uh, yeah, it's gonna move things anyway. Duh. 
the perfect run is gone. God, it's so many moves. I keep getting these in weird spaces. This is this is not good. Maybe at least like a clear. If only I could get them in like really good spaces. There you go. God, 13 moves. <laughs> okay. Well, bye bye, perfect run, but it's okay. Um, um, oh, it is a Lynn. River? Oh, where did she go? Uh oh. Uh, anything in this room? Nope. Okay, we're just leaving then. Where did she go? I need. Oh, the box. New box is a plain paper. Uh-oh, I think I know where this is going. Piano? An old baby grand piano. How the heck did they move this thing upstairs? Who knows, but I bet it'll be a piece of cake for the TARDIS. Not really, you can't even get it through its door. Hmm, true. Well, that settles it. Moving pianos is a pain in the butt for everybody. It'll probably take an entire episode to get it inside. I wouldn't mind seeing such an episode. Me neither. It sounds pretty epic. Okay, we got the two from here. Pianos have babies. <laughs> I don't know why it's called a baby grand piano, to be fair. You went out for a haircut this early in the morning? Hmm. What are you making there? Rabbits. Did you see the rabbit I left for you? Yeah. Tell me about that rabbit. Huh? Describe the rabbit. Uh, it was yellow. What else? A bit puffy. And? Uh, uh, well, it's just a paper rabbit. I don't know how else to describe it. Oh, she looks sad. You're acting strange, River. Is something wrong? River? Uh-oh. I don't know about you, but I'm getting some inverse deja vu. I think I know of her condition, but this is rather odd even for that. You think she's... Do you? Perhaps. Who knows? But like you said, she's not her client. She totally is. I, I, I don't know what they mean by this. Let's just get what we were paid for over with. Many long strands of orange hair. Did she cut her own hair or is her hair falling off? Yeah, that's the memento. This wrist rabbit? So, this is the day she started it, huh? Okay, we got We got the last one. Ding. We are... This is adulthood. Yeah, I think we're, we're, we're on adulthood right now. We went from middle, middle age adult old man. We're already on the, the adulthood. And I guess... We're probably gonna have another stage of adulthood and then we're gonna go to teenager, I'm assuming. Dun dun. Dun dun. There 
you go. Memento, prepare. Da 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 da. It's the platypus. Oh, if it isn't Larry the platypus. Oh god. Ooh, okay. Um. And clear this. And bada beam bada boom. There you go. Three turns. I got it in three turns. Nice. Nice. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Easy, easy, easy. <laughs> ba, 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 ba. Okay, here we are. Da, 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 da. Like to work for Chiaki. We got it. The platypus? Nope. I thought there would be something important with the platypus since it seems to come up a lot in the memories. Do, 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 do. I guess we gotta go to the house. Or actually, I'm pretty sure this is before they built the house. Because I think they started building the house when they were like around middle age. Middle age adults. Okay. Are they here? This is where the house used to be, isn't it? The house that never should have been. I mean, really, what is it about unusually high and dangerous places that attracts people? Acrophobia. <laughs> I guess he doesn't... he doesn't like high... high places. People love being up. I mean, some people enjoy high places, other people don't. Okay, we're missing two. Oh. You had a mustache back then. <laughs> Is that why you approached me back then? Yeah. What about now? I suppose it's just a part of it. Look, it was a long time ago. It's not too relevant now, but Izzy said I should tell you the truth. I shouldn't have tainted our first meeting like that. What happened? What happened during the first meeting? Oh boy. Oh. What is that? What is that? A, a sack? Can you throw this as far as where Anya's at? I don't know. You want me to try? Would you? Oh, okay, I guess you were just... That's littering! Why are you littering? Oh my god. River! Are you insane? Get away from there! She just stood at the very corner of the cliff. Jesus. He just threw it into the ocean? Yep, apparently. I think this memory isn't too far from the last. I think they think they may be connected. Probably. Just casually throwing that thing into the ocean for no reason whatsoever. Hey, what was that for? Okay, there's one more. Okay, probably talking to River? Why did she cut her hair anyway? I like long hair. I don't know, maybe she wanted a short. It's a sacrifice to Anya. <laughs> oh my god, just casually throwing that into the ocean. Memento, prepare. Ideal four moves. If I clear one and then two. Wait, I think this could work actually. Wait. Yeah, one. There you go. No, I did it in five. <laughs> I messed up. 
My calculations failed me. No. <laughs> I did it in one more move. Ah. Oh, what is that? Oh well. <laughs> Everyone with it is different, John. Oh god, not Isabel. Just because she and I share the syndrome doesn't mean we share the same head. But you must be able to help somehow. Everything was okay at first, but now she's even more aloof than before. Even when we're in the same room, she's never really... there. It's starting to take a toll on me. I just don't know how to take it anymore. Well, I can't speak for her, but many of us do long for connections. Though, being able to articulate is a different story. Just because she struggles to express it doesn't mean she doesn't feel anything. She's still there, right? Sometimes you just have to have faith that she cares. That's pretty difficult to do day in and day out. I know. Wait, but why do you seem so normal, Izzy? I mean, don't you have the same condition? For one, I was diagnosed when I was still young. With effort, it's not impossible to acquire a guise of social norms systematically. But you know what? I both envy and pity River. Me? I'm an actress because I've been doing it all my life. Not only on stage, but off stage and at practically every moment. I've gotten good at it because acting is the only option I have. It's the only way for me to be normal. But River? She never did that. She remained an outcast and refused to learn to step against it. I don't know if it was by choice or by limit, whether, brave it, whether bravery or cowardice. There are days when I just can't stand faking it anymore. And then I realize that it's too late. The Isabel that people know... The Isabel that people know of is all in act, and the real me has long become a stranger. I think in the end, I just envy her. Man. Huh. I've never met a woman with it before. Then technically you still haven't met one. This isn't part of our business. Let's move. Uh, yeah, I can't talk to them. I wasn't expecting this. Yeah, this, this game gets really, really sad. The world will be a lot more beautiful if people just remember faces more. I mean, there's, there's a limit as to how many faces your brain can remember. Yeah. Pretty much, pretty much what you see is what you get. <laughs> Anything new today? No. What are you rereading there? The Emperor's New Clothes. I loved this when I was young. Still do, huh? Of course. Just for different reasons. When I was a kid, I loved the Animorph series. I, I hear that name a lot, but I never, I never watched the Animorphs. Like, I, a lot of people mentioned the Animorphs, but like... <laughs> I never watched them, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure what the Animorphs are. I barely remember anything. I have selective memory. <laughs> Animorph is so good, but it's very weird. Is it? Is it that weird? Animorphs is an interesting series for sure. Never read it, but I saw it a lot in my school book fairs. Oh, from there are those silly pictures of people becoming animals. I, I think I like I need to like Google it because like a lot of people mentioned it before, but I just never. I just I just have never seen it. I know your mother gave you a book from it as a wedding present. Ah yes, congrats on getting married, son. Have a book of animorphs. 
have an Animorphs book. That is an interesting wedding present. <laughs> like, you would, you would think, like, when you get married, I don't know, they'll give you money or, like, things for your, like, house or something. Nah, have, have an Animorphs book. <laughs> this, this will definitely explain. <laughs> Hey, so this will definitely be useful now that you're married. <laughs> uh, Animorphs book for a wedding gift? That's an interesting choice. Animorphs for a wedding present is such a troll. That's an interesting wedding present for sure. <laughs> yeah, that was one odd wedding present. I guess I was pretty obsessed with it when I was a kid. Why haven't you read them since? Hmm? I saw them. They're collecting dust in the garage. Well, I just grew out of them, I guess. I mean, they're children's books. What's wrong with reading children's books? They're comforting. I suppose so. I think I'm going to get this one. I never said the presents have to be useful. <laughs> if someone did that to me, my only thought would be, what are you trying to tell me here? <laughs> That's your first thought process. Like, what is the meaning of this? What are you trying to tell me here? Well, what is trash for others is precious to another one. That is true. They do say that another man's treasure is... Another man's trash is another man's treasure. I'm missing two more. I need... Oh, this guy. Maybe you have something. Oh. Hmm. Oh wait, I can talk to him. Forget about Waz reverse like me for real, for real. But what about David? He's my favorite character. Uh, I don't know. What are you talking about? Animorphs. Have you read it? Who's David? <laughs> oh my god. No. Yes. Really? Sort of. Oh, oh! Do you know what animal is David's main morph? I... I don't... <laughs> Wait, I don't know. What is... What is it? I don't know. Animorphs. I'm about to Google it. David. Animorphs. I can't find it! <laughs> Look at all you crack lab. Uh, let's see. What animal is he? His name is David. He found the blue box. He has tasted the Animorphs' power. He knows all of their secrets and he can't be trusted. Is he a villain? Where's David supposed to be? I need a picture. The wiki is not being very helpful. Wait, he has 11 morphs? He's OP. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, he's OP. He has 11 morphs. His golden eagle, lion, cockroach, seagull, flea. A two human forms. An orca. A human, another human form. And a rattlesnake and a rat. Why does he have so many? He's too OP. He needs to be nerfed. <laughs> but it says his main morph is a lion. His main morph is a lion, even though he has a lot of them. <laughs> He's too OP. He needs to get nerfed. <laughs> oh my god. This is uh, this is very uh, riveting. <laughs> okay, well. It's a lion. Um I know it. I know it. It's a lion. It's a lion. <laughs> Lie. Wait, what? It's not a lion. This is this is five letters. Lions. How do I delete? Uh oh. Lions. <laughs> Where's not an animal anymore? He's a shapeshifter. That doesn't sound right. Don't worry, I'll find out for you. No, wait, wait, I know, I know. <laughs> He's just serving to multiple. Wait, let me add it again. Yes, it's a, it's a lion. You should be able to delete with escape, can't you? It doesn't, no. Escape doesn't allow me to delete. Lion. What? Google lied to me! 
Wait, what, what is it then? He has like 11 of them, but Google said the lion was the main one. What? I don't know what his main anamorph is. <laughs> Where's the anamorph expert? I'm not yours, you're not mine. Be my anti valent <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, Riffer, this one's not that corny. I'm not yours, you're not mine. Be my anti valentine <laughs> Oh my god. River? It's a cobra? Wait, is it? If it is human, I mean, you could try cobra. He has 11 of them, so it's kind of... Cobra. It is! What? Apparently the game dev thinks is a cobra. I literally looked in the Animorphs wiki, and he doesn't have cobra. He has a he has a rattlesnake, but rattlesnakes are not necessarily cobras. And that's not even the main one. It says the main one is a lion. I got lied to. <laughs> he has a pet cobra. Yeah, but that's not his main animorph. His main animorph is a lion. I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna buy the Animorphs books just so I can become the Animorph expert. <laughs> uh, more fans about to riot. <laughs> oh god. Jesus. Cobra Kai never dies. I feel like you found live, did it? What is David's main and main? Mo main and a morph. Okay, let me see. I'm googling. <laughs> Who is morph. Yeah, it says in the wiki his main battle morph was a lion. Yeah, everyone is asking about that because to the moon says that it's a cobra. <laughs> oh god, someone <laughs> Someone actually wrote in the in the um in the uh they actually wrote in the Steam community. Tiny little nitpick. Everywhere I look says David's main morph was a lion. Also he morphed into a rattlesnake, not a cobra. See even on his main morphs. David Animorph. Yeah, the, the, the pretty much. <laughs> oh, there's like some people saying that the Cobra thing is wrong. Literally unplayable. <laughs> uh, dude, Dev can be his main Animorph with beloved pet. Because yeah, they say he can turn into a rattlesnake, but not into a, a an actual Cobra. But yeah, pretty interesting. <laughs> but yeah, there's even like a small thread on Steam about people getting mad because it's like nitpick, but actually, actually, David's main animorph is a lion. <laughs> I mean, I don't know animorphs, so for all I know, the wiki could be lying. But even someone wrote about it, so maybe it's not just me. <laughs> I really wish they kept the old covers instead of these plain sheets. Those are cool. Actually, actually, David's David's main animorph. <laughs> it's weird because in the book covers he appears as a cobra as well. It's really, really odd. Decisions were made. I'm trying to see where do you even find the answer? Do you just Google it? I mean, we pretty much have to Google it. I can't really click on any books. Oh, maybe. Do they even mention what the Animorphs thing is? Oh! Here they go. Tobias Hawk, uh, Rachel Grizzly, Jake Tiger, Marco Gorilla, David Cobra, Cassie Wolf. Why? Yeah, pretty much the, that's a... Uh... And they got the thing right with Jake, with it being the tiger. <laughs> Next he'll tell me the dev line with the title, we're not going to the moon. <laughs> Imagine if they actually excited you to just Google the answer. <laughs> 
I mean, unless you're a big Animorphs fan. Tobias Hawk, Rachel Grizzly, Jake Tigler, Marco Gorilla, David Cobra, Cassie Wolf. Why? Oh, uh, just wondering. You could have just Googled. <laughs> She's calling me out. <laughs> oh my gosh, she knew. <laughs> she was aware. She was aware of this. Ain't no way. <laughs> I actually expected you to do it. Oh god, she knew. <laughs> she really said it. She was aware that I was gonna do this. <laughs> It's so funny because you forbid us from Googling the answers for the Wiki House stream. I mean, that's different. That's like a full on quiz. It's like a full on quiz. It, it would take away all the fun. It would take away all the fun if you Googled the answers on the Wiki House quiz. Okay, uh, where's the last? Oh, okay. There you go. Yeah, she was aware. <laughs> Memento, prepare. Okay. Then I can... Three, four... And five! Wow! There you go, got it. Five moves. The Animorphs. <laughs> okay. Da, 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 da. Of course, we're getting the Animorphs as a memento <laughs> after this entire discussion about Animorphs. Aww, everyone's leaving already? But I just got here. Seems to happen to you a lot at parties. Oh, go save your childish dabs for the insecure. Oh, pickles. An ace animorphs book. Oh, is this the wedding? I see Le Fromage, but where's the mousse? That's the corniest remark you made all night. Don't you mean cheesiest remark? Wow. Oh god, he tried, he tried. What? <laughs> he tried. There was an attempt. Whether it's a good or bad attempt, I'll leave that up to you. Uh, I don't think there's anything else here. Mm, nope. Okay. Let's get out of here. Who wants to get better material? <laughs> he tried. Kinda, I think. Dun, 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 dun. Oh! Well... Guess the, the, the couple just kind of escaped their entire wedding party. I mean, the party is not looking very, uh, very, very bright, to be fair. Everyone's just kind of sitting there. <laughs> but I mean, we did freeze time, so maybe... It's not like that. A peculiar couple, yep. They're they're quite peculiar, huh? Do you feel any different? Yeah, is this one No that we got the rings on, I mean. No. Why why? Do you? Actually, yeah, I think so. Like, we're officially married, now what? <laughs> what is it like? It's just different. Very descriptive. It, just the responsibilities, I suppose. Responsibilities. Do you like the name Anya? Hmm... So this is when they came up with the name for the lighthouse. Would you... like to name her Anya? Well, I guess the lighthouse is officially named. I understand. 
They adopted the lighthouse. Yep, this is when they adopted the lighthouse. Yeah, Ani has a good name for her. Is this a spying family reference? No, this game... I, I don't know if this was around when the manga was around. I don't think so. This game is pretty old, so I pretty I think this might have been before Spyx Family. Hey, come with me. Where Spyx Family is a to the moon reference. And here I thought the lighthouse was named after someone or something, but nope, they just straight up named it. Yep, they just straight up named it. It's just like, yeah, we're just gonna name it. No, nope, it's just it was just named. Oh! Naruhodone. <laughs> this can be a good idea. I'll probably trip and fall. Don't worry. Just follow my steps. Oh, they're, they're dancing? Oh, they're dancing in the lighthouse. Oh my. <laughs> they're dancing! <laughs> good job, John. You're ruining the moment. I think you stepped on my toes. Sorry. Come on, let's try again. You're dancing. You ruined the moment! Just casually dancing in this abandoned uh, lighthouse. Why are, all, why are all of our protagonists so clumsy? <laughs> I don't know, it just happens, I guess. We just get the clumsy protagonists. To promise to love and comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. I do. And do you take this man standing before you to be your lawfully wedded husband? To promise to love and comfort, to honor and to keep in sickness and in health for as long as you shall live. Yes. <laughs> Just yes. Yes. By the power invested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Pati pati pati. <laughs> sure, I guess. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I present you Mr. and Mrs. Wiles. Pati 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 pati. Officially married. Wow! Ugh, the wedding. <laughs> it's just like me. Uh, yeah, what do you think that was? I'm just bad at weddings, that's all. Fluids tend to escape from my eyes. I didn't know you were that sentimental. Oh, did I say my eyes? I meant my mouth. <laughs> oh, that's weird. And by fluids, I meant both fluids and solids. You. That's a lovely image. Thanks, Neil. Come on. Let's find a way to get out of here. All this happiness and joy is really putting you off too, huh? No, I just don't like watching people make mistakes. Sheesh, whatever happened to you? Jeez, whatever happened to just take it moment by moment? Okay. Interesting. Well, that was something. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here. Da 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 dum. Okay. Uh, let's talk to them. Ba da 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 dum. Oh, I better go see how your aunt is doing. Alright. Alright, Ma. Tell her thanks for coming. I will. Who's this? Oh. Who's this? I'm so proud of you, Jelly. Oh, is that his mom? I think that's his mom. The straight up color wedding of a stick. <laughs> that's savage. <laughs> He's very savage. What can I say? So. I mean, we know Watts is very savage. Um. Joey? Oh, that's my grandpa's name. He passed away before I was born. Ma calls me by it as my nickname. It was the other doctor though, was it? it, it it's really hard to tell because they look... 
he, he looks really crunchy. The pixels look really crunchy. They're both in their own ways. <laughs> How come you never told me about it? Oh, so I'd rather you call me John. Ugh, not another sentimental grandparent childhood. What do you have against those anyway? I mean, you sure talk about your grandfather a lot. What? No, I don't. Whatever you say. Okay, Jelly. Uh, let's see. Anyone else? I think you meant it, Rosalie, and I called it the wedding a mistake. Oh, I mean, she kind of... She kind of did in a way, didn't she? <laughs> and always is the reason why he hates Johnny. I mean, he was... Maybe. It could be. I'm so proud of Jilly. I mean, he likes he he likes being called yeah Johnny instead of Jilly. Oh, we're missing one orb. Maybe it's down. Is there anywhere down we can go? Hmm. Where could that last one be? I don't think it's in the wedding area anymore. It's probably just somewhere around here. Oh, yep, here they are. Uh, not the cars. Oh. <gasps> no, they ran over a bunny! Dead rabbit. Oh, no. It can't be helped, the river. I'm sure they didn't mean to. Come on, we're late. Wait, is that a rabbit? I think this is the surface of all those folded paper ones. Why was she obsessed over some roadkill? Not to mention so many years later. Don't ask me. <laughs> this guy. I'll be convinced that I'm the only one when you do a courtless bungee jump. Oh, so it's pretty much... It was a rabbit he had a bar. <laughs> I think it's just some roadkill that she saw. They didn't run over it. I thought they actually ran over it by accident. I don't know. They just stumble upon it on their way to the wedding. What? Dot, dot, dot. He is a, he's an individual, alright. And... Three moves. And two, and three. There you go. Three moves. Maybe it was one of the guests. Yeah, I'm assuming one of the guests probably ran over it. You know it's a fantastic wedding when the mementos wrote... <laughs> what? Please, stop! Hey! Maybe she saw it as a metaphor for the terrible marriage. Oh my god, please no. So years later, she began folding the rabbits because she was reminded of how rotten it was. Or, you know, something equally pretentious. Cool story, Neil. This dude. Oh my god. <laughs> this dude. Oh, the Rokita was already here, though. Poor thing, what's with all the road kills today? Don't you look at me like that! Smells like a farm. And roadkill! He had to be the sun simulator or get away from here already. How many road kills they saw? Apparently there's a lot of road kills in this area, it seems. Horse! Pretty horse! Uh, is that a... No, it's not a memento. I thought it was for a second. <laughs> I'm trying to find... Oh! Oh, God! <laughs> uh, I forget that I'm invisible, but I saw the chuck and I just... I think Rosaline got run over, you know? Whoa! Don't do it! Oh, we're about to be an isekai. <laughs> I saw the truck. Don't do what? You know what. 
Do not, don't not ride this horse. What are you, five years old? Okay, I won't not ride it. <laughs> Hiya! Quit wasting time, Neo. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> that can't be good. Do something! Don't just stand there, help me! This was not in the job description. Uh-oh. <laughs> I would have I would believe it if Watts was actually fine. <laughs> well, he's he's gone now. He got taken away by the horse. <laughs> well, GG. Oh man. Oh, there's River over here. Can we talk to her? Hmm. I don't... Oh, wait, I thought I saw something for a second. No. We have to get on the horse to trigger it, the scene? Oh, there you go. Is that really a good idea? She should be okay. She's, she's not new to this anymore. But she has never done it by herself before. I'll be fine. I'm not a child. Ah! Oh. River! There she goes. Not her first rodeo. Nuh uh, not her first rodeo. Rip Watts, never to be seen again. Kidnapped by horse and die. <laughs> Horsing around. What's the matter? Let's go. Hey, wait up! Oh, huh. I wonder if Neil got off the horse yet. Ooh, Eva! <laughs> oh no. This is about 19% more than I can handle. What a moron. Do we get to ride the horse? Oh, what the corn cob. Let's go! We got to press space to gallop. Okay. Gotta go fast! Do 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 gotta go fast. Oh god, Neil is zooming! Neil! Try to catch up to him! Oh my god. <laughs> Neil! <laughs> oh god. No 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 please. Oh, I don't think I can actually catch him. Sorry, Neil. I I guess I'm just gonna have to leave you. <laughs> horse gaming! It's horse gaming time. Oh. I thought I broke it for a second. <laughs> okay, so I need to find... ...the things. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm, where are the other orbs? Do we just need to keep galloping? Horse races betting. The horse races. Bum, ba -da -bum, bum, 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 bum. I'm pretty sure I already took the... Or at least most of the area. Dun. Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. But it's fun galloping around. Or maybe I need to talk to them? Nope. And Neil keeps zooming around. How many... Oh, I can't check my orbs from here. Let me see if I can talk to maybe River or John. There's this person here. Uh, where did they go? Wait, I lost them. Did they already stop galloping? Oh, no, there they are. There's River. River! Come back. Okay, there you go. I got them. I need her to catch up with her. Uh, now to find the actual memento. Is it the horse? Is it the horse that, um, Watts is on? Boy, watch. Stay still. Oh! Thanks! How? Okay, there you go. <laughs> that worked. Yeah, I had to actually catch up to River. You cute! <laughs> You'll be fine. Okay, where is he? Uh, Where are you? He isn't flying, but I don't know where he is. Um... Oh, there you are! Hi! Here, this mental deal! 
But I'm not getting on that horse again. You go get the rest of the memory links. It's never speak of what had just happened again. Do I not have all of them? I thought I had all of them, but I guess not. Oh, there you go. Uh, there you go. Nice! Memento. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, let's see. Uh, maybe do a diagonal. Is Yeah, there you go. Two, three, and four. Nice! Ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. Four moves! Solved it instantly. <laughs> there you go, we got it. Activate. Ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Oh, so this is where it, where it all started, huh? Is the diagnosis certain? Yes, we have reached a consensus on the results. Hmm. Unfortunately, like many cases of per pervasive developmental diet disorders, this is a rather late diagnosis. How do, you, how do you know when you were a child, miss? It could have saved you a lot of trouble. Do you have any books on it? Hmm... Uh, this one is by Tony Adwood. He's one of the specialists on the subject. You can borrow it free of charge for now. Just don't elope with it. Thanks, Doc. Now, are you two a couple? Unmarried and without any other current legal affiliation. Yes, I see. Well, I could give you a referral to a specialized counselor, if you wish. Is there anything unsettling in the relationship? No. And you, sir? No, it's fine. Nonetheless, sir, you should also give the book a read. It would help you understand her condition, too. I would... Rather not. The worst she can say is no, unmarried and without any other legal affiliation. Is this memory from later? It's earlier. We're going backwards, so this is earlier. This is before marriage, so... We started from here and we're going all the way back. Why is that? Well, it's your call. In the meantime, there's a thing called equin... Equin? Equine? Horse! That's all you need to know. <laughs> it, it's horse! That might help her. A ranch just north of here offers it. I can contact them for you. Yeah, horse therapy in other words. <laughs> Told you so. And he's read the same. Just the same equine. Equine. <laughs> okay, uh. Oh, platypus. A stuffed toy platypus. I can't believe this piece of atrocity is dated all the way back here. Looks like someone took good care of it. She's still got pretty bad taste in animals, though. Why do you hate a platypus so much? Why does he hate the platypus so much, man? Excuse me, could you please silence the clock? The ticking really bothers her. It's not that severe. I'll be okay. No problem. It's standard policy. If there's anything at all that makes you uncomfortable, just let me know. I guess he just took... He just removed the batteries. Thank you. We need the platypus hatred lore. <laughs> Yeah. Platypus slander. Oh, I guess that explains the ones in the house. 
Clock ticking. I... Uh... Oh, we probably need to look at this. So... This? Oh, that's the memento. Play. We need two more. Oh, probably them. Uh, just a bit longer. They'll be calling for you soon. Uh, we already got the one from here. We're missing one more. It's not outside, because we can't leave. So it has to be inside. Yeah, probably inside. Oh, this! A plain tawny handbag. There. If I could walk on top of the counter like that without getting in trouble, I'll do it too. <laughs> just casually walking on top of the counter like this. You know, it's no problem whatsoever. Here you go. And memento prepare. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, this one could have been so perfect if it wasn't for this. Mm. Two, three, and four. There you go. Got it. Yes. Activate. Bada bum. Okay, here we are. Oh, movie theater! What we watching? Psst, look! I know, I can't believe he once paid to see this on theaters! Not- No, you idiot! Look, we leaped! <laughs> this guy... <laughs> oh my god, was it really that bad of a movie? Holy overcooked macaroni! The kid's in the theater all by himself! What a loser! <laughs> oh my god! Why, why are you like this a lot? You go to the theater by yourself all the time. That's different. No one's competent enough to match my taste. But that's aside, how could anyone last through this rubbish? Just do it. Surely that's why no one goes to the theater with him. Because his taste is too... too refined. He needs to chill. He always chooses violins. You have to have a really high IQ to like the stuff what's likes. Yep. And thus, this movie sucks on both physical and metaphysical levels. Q-E-D. Come on, let's go. What? Oh, right. Oh, man. Really hate the movie that bad, huh? Oh! Hi there. Whoa, wait, I ain't talking to no emo teenage. <laughs> Grammar, my dear Watson. Shut up, that's not even a full sentence. Let's just go look for mementos. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, uh. Maybe if we go back through this door? Doesn't give us anything. Bum, ba, da, 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 da. Let's see. What could. Oh! Who's. Who's that? Who's this person? Oh! Never mind. They're gone. Wait, who are they? There's a lot of. silhouettes, and they keep disappearing. What does this mean? What are you doing? That's the third person you've removed here. Eh, not like it's permanent. I wanted to... Oh, oh my god, you can remove them! Oh, wait, what happens if I delete all of them? You know that poking them out of the way like that does nothing, right? Then why complain? <laughs> wait, what happens if I keep going? Will he say anything else? I need to find out. It's for science. <laughs> Will he say something if I get everyone out? There's two. There's a couple over here. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Oh, look! This place is all empty and creepy now. 
I hope you're happy. Yes, thank you. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Where's that noise? Oh god, why is it flickering like that? Is it because I deleted it? Like all the people? <laughs> Kiaki's gone mad with the power as soon as she learned she could delete people. Oh god, that's not good. Bad route unlocked. <laughs> Getting stood up now, that's a Kodak moment. You relate well with your kin, I see. What's... Uh, it's... What's Kodak? Is Kodak... Isn't Kodak like a camera brand? Uh... We're missing two mementos, though. Well, there's nothing here. Hate to say it, but I guess I have to nag something out of him again. I think it's the OG disposable camera brand, if I recall correctly. Yes, Codex a camera brand. Yeah, a moment where they're being kept in free. <laughs> oh my god. All yours. At least there's no olives this time. Oh boy, I don't think he's the best person to talk to a teenager. I have a bad feeling. <laughs> Oh, there she is. So he didn't... He didn't get stood up. A river? You weren't there this whole time. I waited for you at the lobby. I thought you didn't come. Why didn't you leave? I thought we were watching the movie together. Huh? I'm the one who should ask that. What do you mean? We were watching the movie together, and then you left. We weren't watching it together. I didn't even know where you were. If you saw me in there, why didn't you come and find me? Ah, yes. Liam wants to talk to the edgy depressed teenager. What could go wrong? What difference does it make? We were watching the same movie in the same room. Ah. Uh. Uh. <laughs> What's wrong? You're so weird. Don't say that. Do you not want to watch the movie together anymore? Of course I do. Come on, let's head back in before it ends. She is though, but you don't say that. You. You just don't say that. That's not a nice thing to say. I feel like I should make a clever remark. You feel wrong. Well, let's hope our ride's waiting for us in there. I believe she prefers when he is direct. Hmm. Uh, is it the platypus? It is. I wonder how the platypus plays in all of this. Okay, there you go. Memento prepare. Okay. Hmm. Five turns, huh? Hmm. Uh, therein lies the issue. Oh, I can actually do diagonal this time. Oh no, I can't do the other diagonal. I thought I could. <laughs> also, Shin, thank you so much for the raid. And welcome, welcome, Raiders. Hope that you had a good stream, Shin. And for the people that don't know me, I am Tiagi Katsumi, Pixeling's resident cat hacker. What were you guys up to? What were you guys doing? Are you always able? I mean the other diagonal. The one from the this side. Diagonal like this. Instead of doing diagonal like this. Yeah, I thought I thought we were able to move this, but I don't think so. Hmm. Interesting. I could just do this, but it's gonna mess yeah, it's gonna mess that up. 
Hmm. Therein lies the issue. Cause I don't wanna I don't wanna mess any of these up, but I I'ma head out to you. Have fun with the stream, Tiaki and Chad. See y'all next time. Bye bye, Blue. Thank you for stopping by. Yeah, welcome, welcome everyone. Trying to see five moves is the ideal. We have 72, so technically we can. If I do this, it's gonna take these out. Hmm. Oh, yeah, this is not it's not gonna be good. Yeah, oh well, the perfect run is gone. <laughs> it doesn't allow me to reset, so... Uh, perfect run is out the window. Nope. Oh god, I put it in such an awkward spot. Hmm... Yeah, this is such a bad spot. I want to reset, but it doesn't allow me to reset it. Oh, I didn't mean to click that twice. Oh, that's bad. Uh-oh. That's not good. This is gonna be a waste of turns. Can I really just not... Yeah. Oh god, no! It's clicking things! Well, this run is so over. <laughs> the first one was really decisive. Probably, but I didn't... I couldn't... I didn't see the vision. Ah, uh, now it's just a mess. It's just a mess everywhere. It's a bunch of, like, spaces that don't really work. Uh, if it wasn't the ones in the middle. Is overall just your total scores of all the puzzles combined? I think so, yeah. Might be. D okay, just infinite. <laughs> that works. God, I'm already at 30 thirds. My god, it, it's already such a bad lineup. I want to reset it because it's really hard to like fix it at this point. Okay. There you go. Finally fixed. <laughs> oh god. It came out counting. <laughs> this is how the game makes a hate of platypus. <laughs> you know, I think this platypus is growing on me. Mostly just for convenience, but hey! Man. It was really hard to fix it after I messed it up. Metal LGG. Come on, dude! <laughs> I'm not gonna say that, but... Oh. It's not that. Look, maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Oh, sheesh. What could possibly happen? The worst she can say is no. Or the worst she can say is we have no... Unmarried and with no legal affiliation. <laughs> uh... Just think about it. Worst case scenario, she says no. Or she says something that hurts more than no. You strut on like nothing happened. No one will know and everyone will still think you're cool. Uh, but what if she tells someone? Or yells at me? Do <laughs> what? <laughs> Don't be a coward! Or... Or says yes but really means no? She quit worrying. Who would do that? You would be surprised the amount of people who would do that. What if she throws an encyclopedia in my face? 
I don't even have a helmet. Dear Lord, I'm so not prepared for this. Dude, don't panic. Just straighten your spine and quit being a coward. Yeah, you tell him. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, God. Everything will be alright. Just turn around. Okay, okay. Hey, 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 what are you? Shh. Oh. Uh, um. Uh, hello? Oh, the, the side eye? She's like, oh, who's this? <laughs> uh. Hello? Can you hear me? Watts has finally found where he belongs in grade school. <laughs> So, hi, hi, Pepega! Welcome, welcome! Yes? Uh, then why didn't you... Uh, never mind. Um, that's a cool platypus you got there. What are you reading? He's trying. He's trying his best. A book. Uh, fastest way to end the conversation. About platypus? No. Oh, I uh, I think that's great. <laughs> the face pop in the background. Hey, you wanna lighthouses? Huh? There are exactly 16 second order Freshnel lens lighthouses in the country left. Nine of them are coastal, and one of them was modified from a historic kerosene lamp lighthouse. Oh, uh, is that what you're reading about? So that's why she really loved Anya. Yeah, she really likes lighthouses, and it's one of the few remaining ones. Awkward. Um, say, you wanna go catch a movie together sometime? D I don't know. That's okay. I'll give you time to consider it. I can't. Why? There's no date or time. Uh, I play this one's really great story. It's a, it's a really good story, yeah. She's so real. <laughs> Thinking back on it now, Watt's first impression of Johnny is a man on his deathbed. So there's a special source for this cringe of watching this awkward young lad. I mean, he's pretty much watching all of his memories, yeah. Oh, uh, how about this Saturday at 8? Oh, is that a no? Well... Oh... Ava, I think the system fro- Yes. <laughs> she was taking so long, he was like, Hey, I, I think this thing froze, she she's not answering. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, great! Never mind. I guess we'll work out the details later. <laughs> um, I'll just... Uh... He's face palming again! <laughs> oh my god. What? What are you looking at me for? Mm hmm You think I'm going to call out how utterly awkward that was? I mean, you you kind of you kind of were showing it. Well, just forget it. I'm not giving in to your expectations. Give him a break. He was still just a kid. You of all people should relate. What's that supposed to mean? Shut up and go. Shut up isn't my name, you know. Oh my god. <laughs> What do you mean awkward? Johnny's got a date. He got he got the date. I think I'll die of embarrassment if someone saw my middle school race. 
I mean, I'm pretty sure everyone is cringe during middle school. Well, I suppose if you look at it from the right angle... No, not really. Never mind. Oh, so that's not the, the memento. Oh. What the heck were you doing in there, dude? What? I asked her out. No! That was pathetic! If I were you, I would've just barged in there and be all like... Hey, you! Go out to me, you now! This guy... <sighs> Not this guy... Azul, hi, hi, Kumo! Welcome, welcome! That's just terrible. I know, and it would've still been better than what you just did. Bros. So, did she throw an encyclopedia in your face? Huh? Did she? Shut up, dude. See? I'm not the only one who tells people to shut up. And suddenly, I feel loved. <laughs> this dude. Nicholas is away with words. The game in kind, but words for sure. <laughs> in a terrible alternate dimension, Nick... Oh my god, no. Okay, yeah, they don't say anything else. I wanted to see if he said anything else. Uh, oh, what do you have to say? Leonardo da Vinci trained by drawing eggs. Barrels are also very big eggs. Therefore, you will all be very big da Vinci. <laughs> okay. Sure. That, 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 uh, that's how the logic works. Dear lord, I can't believe you got me to take this stupid class. Oh, come on, it's fun. Only if you can paint. You'll get good if you practice, you know. Yeah, right. After this class, I'm never picking up a brush again. What do you mean? This is a very nice art piece. Why do we have to draw stupid barrels anyway? Because they are like eggs, and Leonardo da Vinci used to draw eggs. <laughs> Therefore, you'll all become great Leonardo da Vinci. <laughs> that, that, that was what the teacher said. Therefore. <laughs> That's why you have to draw barrels. Because they are like eggs. And Leonardo da Vinci used to draw eggs. Uh, barrel equal egg. Exactly. Simple math. Oh, so hi, hi, Satoshi. Welcome, welcome. Anyone? Anyone at all? Hmm. Uh oh. All right then. Oh, he's gonna pick someone. Uh oh. River, why don't you answer it? I know you know the answer. We're waiting, River. Oh, I hate when they do that. Like we're waiting. Come on, we don't have all day. You gotta answer. Oh, I hate... I hated that. I hated that so much. <laughs> he went for the index cards. Oh, not the index cards. Fine. I guess we'll have to. He made sail on August 3rd of 1492 from the Spanish city of Palos de la Frontera, which was founded in 1322 and granted to Alvar Perez de Guzman, who was at the mere age of 14 by the... Okay, okay. I only asked for the date. But see, was that so hard? Oh, being called out in front of the class, yeah, that was that was the worst. He's that kind of teacher, yeah, the one that just picks on the person that is the most quiet. Good lord, does everyone with her condition have near photographic memory? Not really, though. I think their road to memory is often fairly strong. She got the whole story, all the details. She isn't quiet though, she talked a lot. I mean, yeah, I say... Not necessarily quiet, but more reserved. I mean, she seems like the more reserved kind. From what they've been showing, at least in her school years. And even then, when she was married, she only really spoke to... Johnny. She was not really... That super talkative? She's coming this way! I'll tab! I'll tab! What are you guys looking at? I'll tab Alt 4!
Okay. Also, hi, hi, Angel! Welcome, welcome! Okay, so no orbs in here. Can I go in here? Locked. Cafeteria only open during lunch hours, so not here. Okay, yeah. Nothing here. That's a wrap! You chumps better be, uh, better next time! Ah, uh, an atrium. We could use this place later. I just can't believe that these court lines are rectangles in his head. Oh, can we move this? Nope. Oh. View. There you go. Ugh. Fine, you win. Booyah! Okay, I, I believe it should be... Oh, anything up here? Mm, nope. Nothing up here. Should be lunch hours, maybe? So ca is the cafeteria open? Oh, yep, there they go. Cafeteria's open! Okay. There he is. I realized that comment wasn't a knock on RPG Maker textures. Danny legit thinks that basketball court lines are angular. <laughs> yeah, she's unique, but she's uniquely boring. I mean, just look at her. What do you mean? I think she's I think she she's she's cute. She just sits there by herself all day with that creepy deformed duck toy. That's not a deformed duck, that's a platypus. What the heck is a platypus? Quit making words up. Nicholas ain't got taste. He, he got no taste. Anyway, she's just so off, you know? It's like she's from a totally different planet or something. I know, isn't that cool? Uh, if you're into aliens and that sort of stuff, I guess. But really, if you want to be weird, why don't you just go hang with the emos and goths? Well, for one, I don't want to ruin my hair. The fact that we got a name for them says a lot, too. Look, Nick. I just... I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of typical people. Wow, so deep. But how the heck would being with her change your own identity? I mean, you would just be some guy who hangs out with a shy girl. She's not just shy, Nick. There's something strange about her. Being strange isn't always a good thing, you know. Do you even know if she wants to be different? Maybe she just wants to fit in like everyone else. And if she does, pushing her to pushing her the other way wouldn't help, would it? Look, Nick, the point is that I know what I need. <laughs> I know what I need. <laughs> You're aren't you in like grade school? Yeah, what do you mean you know what you, what you need? You're in grade school. I don't think you know what you need. And she's the one who has it. What is it that you need? <laughs> so, you want her for what she has, but not for her. That's cold, man. I just hope you know what you're doing. Oh, this is what he meant with ruining their first meeting like this. Yeah, because he said it, like, back in the wedding. He said... Uh, I think it was a little bit later, actually. That he said something about, like, Yeah, I feel bad for ruining our first meeting like this. I do. I think you're wrong, though. People aren't that typical. Everyone's unique in some way. That's just what grandmas tell you. Man. Wait, so this guy's some kind of human hogging hipster. That's sort of uh disturbing. You know, sometimes I want to slap our clients upside the head. It's high school, everyone's a jerk. But hey, welcome to the club. Oh, this is high school. I thought they were younger. Wait, so this is what he told her about at the cliff. Yeah, this is this memory. I suppose so. 
she then went, uh, she then went cuckoo and began to make those creepy rabbits, right? Because he confessed this from who knows how long ago? I guess she's pretty good at holding a grudge. I don't think it's related to that. Not fully, I would say. I'm not buying it. Something feels missing. Then go get a hat, Sherlock! Come on, I think our passport's leaning against the table there. Yeah, that's the, the backpack. Young Johnny was quite a jerk, yeah. I kinda have to agree with Nicholas, but uh, he makes some good points in this... At least in this uh, time period. Like, yikes, bro. Reasons and intents aside, it's pretty remarkable that they actually met in high school. How many of those go on for more than a month nowadays? I don't know about you, but mine went pretty swimmingly. Yeah? So swimmingly, it swam right out the window. <laughs> oh, it does. Sounds about right. Bro. <laughs> I just love how every time we see this thing, we're guaranteed a free memory link. It must have left as big of a scar on his mind as it did on mine. What's had a girlfriend? Apparently. Apparently he did. Once upon a time, he did. Oh. It's probably Nicholas. My mom that this kid was still there to help him move pianos when their hair grew white. I wish I was still in contact with my childhood friends. Wait, no, he doesn't have the last one. Hmm. I can see why she broke up with him. Yeah. Should I even? No need. I'm all good now. Kame! Oh, for Walnut's sake. Kame! Hey! Not cool, Eva. You never b b b block someone in the middle of a Kamehameha. What? No, she caught him off. Yep. She caught him off. Okay. Oh. First move. Mm. Maybe the diagonal might be better first. That's illegal. You just you simply don't do that. Six moves is ideal. Okay. Oh. Why this? Yeah, it's gonna leave this weird empty space here. Can I really do this in six moves? I mean, probably. I just need to see it. See the vision. Yeah, I don't think it's worth flipping all of these. Hmm. If I flip this first, and then flip this, and then just pretty much do this, maybe? Yeah, there you go. Got it. There you go. Six moves. There you go. It's done. Oh. I'm going to school now, Ma. Have a nice day, Jelly. My baby boy, growing up so fast. But he doesn't like the name Jelly, though. Hmm. 
Bada bum 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 bum. Ugh. What if he was a girl? Would she still nickname him after his grandpa? It wouldn't be that bad, actually, since it ends in A. Joey, Julie, Julie. Sounds cute. If it sounds so cute, why don't you marry him? Ah, jealous. Oh, yes, yeah, so jealous. Well, to be fair, a ticking clock is pretty annoying indeed. Uh, is there something in the room? Let's see. Oh, we got one just for entering the room. Oh, soccer ball. Oh, never mind. That's the memento. <laughs> It ends in A. Uh, oh, pickles. Oh, bleh, not again. A glass bottle of pickle cucumbers. <laughs> You're pretty easily impressed. Okay, anything else here? We're missing two. Uh, the study? Oh, over here. Various books with smudged titles. Uh... I think anything else is outside, not here. Da, 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 da. Can we go outside? Wait. No, we cannot. It has to be in here then. I already checked that. Oh, the couch? Not olives, these are cucumbers. Okay, it was the couch apparently. <laughs> I was like, what am I missing? Apparently, the couch. Okay. Memento prepare. Oh god, they're getting more complicated. Um. Mm. My my. Hmm. Uh... Hmm. Alas. <laughs> I could try this. It's gonna get rid of these three. No. I could just. Hmm. Six moves, huh? Oh god. Uh, I do this. Gonna clear all of this except this. There's still this section. Hmm. One, two, three, four. Yeah, but this destroys too many things, so it might be better to just use this. Maybe. Uh, I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> Actually, on second thought, it might not work. Yeah, it's a, it's not gonna work out. I do this one, it's gonna take this off. So I like, kinda don't wanna do that one. But I think I might have to. Yeah. I think this might just... <laughs> it's not gonna fix it in three other moves. So if I do this, it takes off... There's just, like two on these. So unless I do this, but that's just gonna cause more of a mess. Oh. Hmm. Conundrum. What a conundrum. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking. I'm trying to think how I can solve this in three extra turns. But... Yeah, I don't know. We'll get rid of these two, but yeah, it doesn't doesn't work. I do this line. Gets rid of these three. Cover these two. I 
just don't see the point of destroying this. Definitely possible and for you to just gotta figure out the right order. Yeah, the right order is the big one here. This fixes the most, but it also destroys this. Which I could try to fix with this. And then just diagonal it. Hmm. No, but even if I pull a diagonal, it's not gonna fix this. If I do this, it's gonna destroy this one, but this would just remain. Actually, maybe? There you go! I kept doubting myself! <laughs> oh my god. There you go. Now I'm free. Activate. <laughs> oh my god. All this pain for a football. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All this pain for a soccer ball. Or football. Whatever you want to call it. Ugh, it smells like roadkill again. Where are we? Ava? Oh! What is that? Uh-oh, that sounds like trouble. Oh, is it his memory? Oh no. The void! Oh no, that does not sound good. His house is all the way over there. Dun 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 dun. That's his next memory. Yeah, but why is it going? <laughs> I don't want to say that because it sounds like a different thing in Spanish. <laughs> Uh, I know they're referring to the Ghibli movie, but it sounds like a different thing in Spanish, so... <laughs> oh, is it a bad word in Spanish? It, it, it is. If you separate those two... ...sentences... Um... It, it is a bad word in Spanish. I don't know, it's just not linking the memories together for construction. You gotta separate la and the other section. <laughs> then you you get the word. There must be a malfunction within the machine's ADD. Again? I thought the last fix was foolproof for another half a year. I can't believe those idiots in the maintenance department. Look, don't worry. We've already got a teenage year save. We might still be able to do this. Alright, but I ain't telling him about this. As long as we succeed, he doesn't have to know. Oh boy, we're not telling him that his memories were falling apart, huh? Well, I guess this is it. There's nothing we can do here. That's gonna make watching Castle in the Sky ten times more funny. <laughs> I've never actually watched the movie... ...before. Ready to finalize before activation? Ladies first! Bum 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 bum. What a shame. I was actually looking forward to it. You haven't? I haven't watched it, no. <laughs> I actually haven't watched that one. Dun 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 dun. Act 2. Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. Oh. We are. Oh. Don't disturb them. They might not wake up easily, but they need the concentration. Oh. 
Oh my. <laughs> da 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 Well, we're back here. Hello. We meet again. And that's all this old folk knows. <laughs> Sorry I can't be more of help. Then that'll have to be enough. Hey, all that's left to do is linking your registered desire to go to the moon to your early memories. Then we'll put the then we'll pull the switch and voila! You'll be on the moon in no time. What? I have a question. If you could make Lily disappear, that means you can alter this world. You know, he's, he's aware. Then, can you not simply make things happen and fulfill my wish here and now? And that would work if this were your one true set of memories. What do you mean? What is it? What is this then? What am I? This is just a copy, a canvas for us to work with, if you will. As for you, you're merely an algorithm trace from Johnny. Enough to reflect his likeness, but far from complete. All we can do is all we can do is to prepare this canvas in a logically consistent way. And then when we transfer your re your registered desire to your childhood, the machine will generate your new life, one where the desire dictates your behavior. The result of that will then be written to the real John. So you see, even if we satisfy you, you're merely a read-only program. I mean, we could reset you over and over again and that's enough. Oh, don't be so sensitive. He's not real, you know. If you truly believe that, why did you even care to explain? I'm just trying to save time. Let's go. Welp. That was rough. Uh, doctor? Is that... what I truly am? Hmm... And of course you're not gonna answer. You're just gonna leave him to question. Congratulations, you gave him an existential crisis now. Oh. Cold, bro. Cold. Ah, all of our night's work. Oh, it's everything linked to his current... To every stage in his life. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, cold, bro. Yeah, and there's the child, the the childhood one. Oh, he's just the head. What the? At least give me a warning first. What can I say? I like being a head. I would ask if that's a pun, but yes, I'm afraid you would say yes. Let's do this fast. I feel silly enough in this form as it is. All we need to do is to pass his desire from the latest memory to the earliest. The latest memory to... To just interact with him? Oh. Line up two matching mementos on the edges to transfer their registered desires. Oh, my... Wait, what do you mean line... Oh, line these. I can line the flowers. But these are the only ones that actually match, though. Uh, the platypus? The bunny is at the bottom, so you line the bunny at the bottom. There's the, the, the other platypus. Oh, but that's not the same platypus. Uh, this is the book. So the book's gotta... Hey, Ava, take this out! Om nom 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 <laughs> Seriously? The book's over here. Why is this one yellow, though? Is this one wrong? Oh! Wait, wait. I did it for a second. There you go. Yeah, now it's linked. And I need to connect the... 
paper rabbit here. Yeah, but if I move the paper rabbit, it's not gonna connect anymore. There you go. Yeah, I need to move this one here. There you go. And here... We move... Oh, the book is all the way over there! No! This is a conundrum. Uh, but now I need to meet, I need to move the rabbit up top. I need to have the rabbit here and the flowers on the other side. Oh, I can't do that. That's annoying. They remain on, don't they? I don't think so, no. I think they all need to be connected at the very end. Do you have to stay linked or is it once they turn yellow? I'm not sure. I'm not sure if they have to stay on or is it once they turn yellow? I mean, we could just pretty much test it, see if it works like this. How about you try without linking just to check? Let me see. Okay, they don't have to stay on. Never mind. I was trying to actually have them all together. But no, they don't have to all stay on. Is this as long as they link once? I thought I had to link everything together. <laughs> like, have it all in a line. Ding! That's about all of the ones we can work with. Ready to pull the switch? You know me, always ready. Also, hi hi Kendrick, welcome welcome. It'll be fun here, but literally impossible. <laughs> I'm not sure if it would even be possible if we had to connect everything from start to finish. Had to see if it was worth a shot. Alright, let's go back. Let's check out what souvenirs he brought back from the moon. Ladies first. Not this time, hon. <laughs> He's too excited. Okay. Da, 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 da. I guess we gotta go back. Da, 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 Is it this way? Wait, how do we go back? Oh, I guess we just touch this. Just touch his old self. This is the same setting as his real- as his real last accessible memory. Usually, there's at least some change. Something isn't right. These memories, they feel more than just having happened again. They are exactly the same. That's impossible, the desire was transferred, was it not? It was. Uh-oh, something's up. Something's off. Okay, can we go inside? If this is indeed the same memory, he'll be at the cliff overlooking the lighthouse. Okay, we gotta go check on him. Okay, what's going on? Yeah, it's the exact same memory. Did it not work? Johnny? Uh-oh. What a pleasant surprise. We don't have any visitors around here. Deja vu again. My name is Dr. Ava Rosaline, and this is... What? I'm not saying it twice. Dr. Neil Watts. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Does that mean he's always had a desire to go to the moon? Hmm, maybe. Maybe that's why it didn't change anything? Oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient, I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Lily? It's repeating everything again. Freeze him, too. Well... Wait here, I'll go send the desire signal again. See if there are any changes. Well, 
A chance for successfully, for sure. Any changes? Not even a hair. How could this be? Even if his desire doesn't work alone, why is there no change at all? Perhaps, perhaps it just needs some provoking to activate. From his early memories? The earliest we can get to. Let's go. Hmm, yeah. Something... Something's going on. Yeah, I guess this is the earliest we can go to. Yana's desire to go to the moon might need some stimulation to be brought up, huh? Well then... There you go! Movies about going to the moon! What the? This wasn't what they said was playing. Oh well. Do you mind, River? No, I like this one. Alright, let's go then. Hopefully that's enough for an ignition. Wait, where is Neil? Wait, where did he go? Oi, Neil. Did you see to the moon? How was it? <laughs> Title drop. Eh, yeah, it has a bit too much pretense for me. I prefer my movies to be a bit more au je ne sais quoi. I don't know what je ne sais quoi means, but... <laughs> Roll credits. Roll credits. They set the title. Title drop. Uh, let me... I guess we could go inside. Is Neil in here? To the moon, darling. Oh, Henry. Dear lord, I'm way too tired and hungry to be constructing movies. <laughs> Oh god, maybe that's why they said it wasn't that good. Guess I should go see if anything's changed with John. Okay, did something change with him? Sorry for making you sit through this, buddy. Okay. Did it work? Oh. It's all the same. I'll have to try igniting it somewhere else then. This is ridiculous. It did not work out. Oh, uh, Lily? Mm, we need another memory. The movie did not work. Perhaps something here could work. I don't have time for her right now. Okay, uh, let's see. What are you guys doing here? It's starting. Let's go get a good spot. Oh. Wait. I don't remember that happening. Something must have changed. Oh, what is happening? What is happening? Hey, don't squeeze. Watts went out for milk. Yeah, he hasn't returned. Oh boy. What is going on here? Not the butterfly effect. Wait a minute. This isn't a real change. This is... May I have your attention, please? Oh my god, what is he doing? <laughs> As you know, I am a representative sent from NASA in all its... <laughs> and I'm here to tell you all about it. Hit it to me! <laughs> Wow, that was terrible. But I digress. Oh no. Anyways, I know that many of you are wondering. What chances do I have of doing something as awesome as adventuring in another realm? To inhale the sweetness of Venus. To swim counterclockwise through the rings of Saturn. Or perhaps just chilling at the backside of the moon. Well, here at NASA, we believe that with enough will, everyone has potential. <laughs> He's recruiting for the NASA. <laughs> it could be you. Or you. 
Or perhaps... You! But I don't want to go to the moon. Then you're in lo- Wait, what? Why not? Why should I? I'm happy here on Earth as it is. Recruiting literal children. <laughs> oh, man. Well, don't you want to go there even a little bit? No, why? Not even a tiny bit? Um, no? <laughs> oh, boy. Well, as an official NASA recruiter, I shall go over some facts about the moon. To start off, the moon is 4.5 billion years old. And do you know that its surface is about as big as Africa? It's true. In fact, if you try to bike around the moon... Oh my god, he's just coming up with things. Also, it takes 1.52... 47 seconds for light to travel to the moon from here. And if you drive a flying car, it takes 130 days. I knew that. And last but not least, people who go to the moon get rich and famous. Are you sure about this last one though? <laughs> and we all know that rich plus famous equals group. So, that concludes my presentation. Remember, NASA welcomes any of you, especially if you're a brunette. Famous? Yes, rich? I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think that worked. I mean, they do be famous, but what about the rich part? <laughs> well, what do you think? Nasa probably wouldn't hire you, but I suppose it was blatant enough for this. Hmm, I do try pretty hard. Are you gonna go see if that worked? Of course, be, be right back. Back. Report. Utter failure. <laughs> oh my god, he really tried. Deuce. Hey, don't get discouraged. I'm sure there's still things to be done. Such as? Well... Well? Do tell. Any ideas? We're, we're taking suggestions. Oh, that for nothing. We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for our treat... But can you afford the lunar trip lottery? If you sell this house, you sure can! <laughs> oh no! <sighs> Is the diagnosis certain? Yes, in fact, we rarely have anyone. Do you know that NASA has excellent healthcare plans? It's true for both you and your spouse. Oh no, they're. Oh god, they're so desperate. Free pony rides in space! Oh look, Lenin, good for you! But here's a riddle. Guess where you should go for the honeymoon? Uh, they're so desperate! <laughs> oh god. The yeah. River? Yeah, I don't think this is working cheap. <laughs> Dang, Nabbit, glass, slippery! Johnny, d John! Uh, what the cucumber? Phew! You know what? This just isn't working. It's more than just not working. It's ridiculous. We're freaking professionals! I didn't sign up for the job to run around yelling at him like an idiot. You didn't? Look, maybe this lack of sleep's getting to us. Had I known that we'll be an all-nighter, I would have brought coffee. I agree. You should have seen the movie I constructed earlier. What movie? Exactly. 
Anyway, as valuable as time is here, this just isn't going anywhere like this. Let's take a break till morning. Hopefully Donnie can hang on till then. I do have some calls to make. Oh man. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, that that was that was an utter failure. <laughs> we couldn't convince him to go to the moon. Even after all our desperate attempts. Man. Hard to please, huh? Um. 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 Cool. It doesn't make sense. Why did the machine have no effect? Johnny's register wished to go to the moon was successfully transferred yet. There wasn't even a trace of him wanting to go to the moon after the transfer. Unless, unless the secondary condition for the desire was changed in the process. Only then would the same desire produce two different outcomes at two different points in time. There's no denying that River played an important role through it all. If there's anything that could have caused the core to change, she would be the top suspect. But out of all things, what exactly caused it? River... Just what exactly did you do? Hmm... So something related... Ah, uh, the sun's rising. Well, he only has two days. We already spent one day, so... We only have one day left before we... We don't have much time left. I wonder if Neil came up with anything. We don't have a lot of time left before he passes. Like, why don't you spend one night? Yeah. We already... This is what we already, like... Used up one night, so we have another one. According to what the doctor said. Ugh, you can smell that squirrel Neil ran over all the way from here now. Where is he? Is he upstairs already? Oh, well... Oh, he's not here. Where is he? Oh. I thought he'll be here. Maybe in here? Nope, he's not in the bathroom. Uh, maybe the doctor knew something? Hello? How is John doing? Barely hanging on. What are you two doing? We just... we just couldn't make any progress. You better be... you better be soon. We don't have long. If you're looking for your colleague, I think he's in the kitchen. Oh, thanks. I, I was I was looking for him. I I appreciate the the heads up. Wait, he's not in the kitchen. Hmm. Well, it's a living room. It's a bathroom. Where is he? Oh. Mama, I don't want to go to school. It's Sunday, dear. Shh, let them sleep. Chinoko. Um, yeah, he's not here. Where do you? Where is he? Gonna eat. See you, everyone. Bye, bye, Fox. Oh, here he is. No, I understand that part, but... Yeah, have a nice meal, Fox. Thank you for stopping by. Okay, do you confirm it in his records? And why again was this information not made available to us? Or the medical doctor, for that matter. Where did you get that coffee? Shh. Are you speaking with Headquarter? Yes, I'll fill you in after. Now, shish. Oh, wait, isn't this... Where did you find it? In the lighthouse before we started. Now, for the last time, shush! Okay, fine. What am I supposed to do then? While I wait. 
We're lacking critical information. We were indeed lacking critical information. Maybe I can talk to Lily while I wait. Nope, we can't even talk to her. Okay, maybe I'll go outside. <laughs> Hmm. What to do in the meantime while he is on the phone? I mean, there isn't much we can do, really. Other than wander around and hope that he finishes the call ceiling. Maybe something relevant in the kitchen? Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, that's just the light. Maybe if I keep bo- No, I can't bother him anymore. <laughs> Uh, lighthouse, maybe? Maybe. Maybe the lighthouse. Let's see if we can leave the area. No! I can't leave. So whatever I have to do, I have to do it in here. Okay, never mind. I can't go to the lighthouse. It doesn't allow me to leave. Okay. Guess I'll go upstairs and talk to the doctor then. Play. Right, yeah, I heard him making phone calls. I know. I know he's making phone calls, but... A selection? Medical journals? Hmm. Here, we gotta start practicing for the next siesta championships. True. Maybe, yeah, the viewer. Could be. The cliff, where you can see the lighthouse. That could be one place where we could go. While we wait. And now we wait. Oh, we're here! There isn't much to see here. Hmm. Nope. Mm. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it. Mm. What else could it be? We can't leave the area of the house, and we have to wait till he finishes his phone call. How long is this phone call? So I'll go to the basement. I'll go here. The very ominous room with the rabbits. Uh, broken music box. And... Not much. Check the funny room. Just did. Uh, oh, what's in here? Having this with dusty books. Mm, boxes? Colored papers. Test is locked. Yep, nothing else to see in here. Hmm. Oh. A box? Also locked. Yeah, nothing really to see in the basement. The kids. Nope, we can't interact with the kids. Doesn't allow me to. Oh, what about this shelf? I don't think I should check this. Oh, this is just, uh, this is the actual Emperor's new clothes. <laughs> Wait, no. Uh, no. Are you done with your phone call? I don't know what to do. He's still on the phone. Right, that part we can do. But what if... Okay, I suppose so. I'm not sure. We'll have to check on that. The last paper River gave to John. <laughs> How much longer? How much longer do you need on the phone? I pretty much already explored the house. It's a rabbit. Yeah, he's not saying anything anymore. Wake up, kids. There's nothing to do. Oh, the piano. Maybe. Poor River. Oh, this is a... There's like an actual... I guess if you want to play it, you can. There's a music sheet. What kind of a song is this? It's just two notes repeated over and over. 
Oh, it kind of is actually. Do, do, do. I really should have watched those two last night. They were up late. Well, it's not an everyday circumstance. I suppose. Oh, was there something you wanted to ask? Uh, I guess I'll talk with you? This is your full-time job, isn't it? What will you do when this is over? What else is there to do? Find a job in the city and live on, I suppose. It's a shame, though. I'm going to miss Johnny in this place. Maybe I'll come back to visit every once in a while. Uh, Tommy and Sarah. So what are you going to tell them about John? I... I don't know. I'll probably make something up, but it's no use. Kids are smart nowadays, so figure it out. Might as well. It's the nature of life. There's nothing to hide. Lily. You know, it's pretty unusual for someone like you to work here. With two children and all, I mean. It's not that bad, really. There's a school bus that passes through here. But how did you even end up here? Well, a few years ago, my husband passed away. What happened? He was in the army. They were the last batch to be deployed overseas. Sorry to hear. I panicked. Our savings were low and the job market was grim. Johnny saw my ad and offered me this job. I accepted with gratitude. This place was peaceful too. It helped me with my grieving. Doesn't the government issue grants to war widows to help them get back on their feet? They do, and eventually I received aid. But by then, Johnny was starting to have trouble on his own. He needed my help. Tommy and Sarah liked this place too, and so we stayed. As for Johnny, he was glad as well. We're going to miss him. I think deep down, he really wanted a family. Well, we're ready. Oh, uh, hey. Before Johnny fell unconscious, he told me that you two would probably be coming soon. He said that he probably wouldn't get the chance himself, but... He wanted me to tell you thanks for him. So, thank you. Hey, maybe now he's done with the phone call? Are you done? He's still on the phone? Oh, he's finally off. He's finally... <laughs> this walks around the house, has like a very long conversation. Yeah, I thought he was still yapping on the phone. <laughs> hmm. What is it? It seems like our little Johnny here has some hidden records from the old days. Hidden records? Hidden medical records, to be exact. Apparently, during his youth, he was administered a large dose of enhanced beta blockers. And what luck, they tend to have this little side effect in a curious thing called memories. Beta blockers? Johnny didn't have a heart condition, did he? Apparently not. Which leads one to wonder if the side effects were intended to be merely just that to begin with. And in such a large amount. Its impact on his memories at the time of administration must have been significant. You think that's what kept us out of his earliest memories? Well, it's not the machine, I'll tell you that. The maintenance department yelled at me for scolding them. So what now? I was just given the reconfiguration frequencies. That should get us past the blockers. And once we're in his childhood, it might finally be early enough to transfer his desire for it to work. Then what are we waiting for? But well, just one thing. Of course, there's always that one thing. In order to activate the new frequencies, we'll need a trigger. A trigger? Something that exists strongly in the bridging, inaccessible memory. And we'll need to give it to John for him to stimulate his memory internally. But what do we know of that? We've only gotten a glimpse of his childhood memories. And even if we find a childhood photo or something, John's unconscious. Yeah, back to square one. You know, this job hasn't been such a pain in the butt for me since Nora's case last year. Who's Nora? Likewise. 
This is killing me. I'm going I'm going out to get some fresh air. Wait. Oh. Ahem, forgot my coffee. Wait, but we still need to solve this though. Can't just leave. It's mouse. Quit barging in and out of doors. The roadkill, Ava, it smells! I know, it's your fault for running over it. What's going on? The children are still sleeping. Oh, wait a minute. The last memory, the one we were stuck at. It was the same smell! What are you two talking about? The olfactory receptors are directly linked to the brain's limbic system, Lily. Ugh, it all adds up. Don't you see what this means? I'm... what? It means that smell is arguably the most effective sense for, mem for memory recall. We can use it as a stimulant to bridge his, his childhood memories. And the best part, even though Johnny is unconscious, he's still susceptible. I... I think I'm missing some vital contextual info on this whole thing. Alright, this is good. This is awesome. Now, you just need to go fetch a piece of that roadkill. Yes, I'll just... Wait, why should I fetch it? You're the one who ran over it. Exactly. I've already done my part. This dude. Oh, you miserable jerk. Um, if it helps, any... I... I have a pair of gloves you can borrow. They're gonna, yeah, they're gonna force him to smell roadkill. <laughs> oh, God. They aren't really disposable gloves, so they'll probably change after this. Well, time to go get the roadkill. My work here is done, but you didn't do anything. Use the ideas guy. You can't force the ideas guy to do labor. <laughs> oh man, I'm actually gonna have to go get the roadkill. GG. He didn't do anything, yet his work here is apparently done. Well, Huh? Deja vu. Deja vu. I've been on this place before. Ba da ba da 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 Wow. Maybe that's what the car hitting the tree was for in the beginning. Hmm. Maybe. And, oh, there's no smoke anymore. Okay. The kind of things this job gets me into. It's not safe to just bring it in a piece of... It's not safe to just bring in a piece of germ-infected roadkill like this. There's a valve container in the car. I would at least make its odor controllable. Okay, I guess we're getting that. It all loops back to the squirrel. It all loops back to roadkill. That's it all goes back to the roadkill. Oh. Oh, where are you going? I uh I gotta go take a leak. Well <laughs> there he goes. Okay, what a mess. The crash shook everything up. Let's see... Sir, there's a bathroom in the house. Exactly, there's a bathroom in the house. Ah, here it is. Receive valve container. Now, to get some of that dirty roadkill. Get this. Ugh. Receive contain roadkill odor. Is he gonna get mad because I used the container? To bring the roadkill. Well, he's a bit too late. I already put the roadkill inside it, so... Too bad. So sad. Well, GG. We shall see how this goes. <laughs> oh! Oh, hey! Did you get the roadkill? It's ready. Great! Go get it set up! I'll be right back! Where are you going? 
I... I gotta... Gotta go feed my digital pet! What? Yeah, dudette, I've been feeling retro! Anyway, hurry and go set things up. I'll be there in no time. What are you? You got someone dying back there! What the potato is he up to? I, f I have no time to check on him now. Yeah, he's acting real sus. What is he up to? What is he scheming? Tamagotcha. <laughs> Tamagotcha. Tamagotchi. The things a dude works a dude does for not working. So when we get to the to that exact point, I'll sound the signal. When I do, I want you to release the ball for about three seconds. Certainly. About time you showed up. Have you made sure the germs are sealed off? Fully sealed and filtered. Not like it'll matter to a dead man. You should know that Johnny's condition is deteriorating fast. This might be your last chance, you two. Whatever you do in there, good luck. The luck's the last thing we need. Oh, and... Off we go! Act 3. They shine their lights at the other lighthouses and at me. That means we're getting close to the ending. We're getting really, really close now. Hey. That was a short act two. Yeah, this, this act two was way shorter. Let's go. Okay, nice. We already got it, all of these, so we don't have to worry about them. <laughs> Just go straight to this. Ba 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 ba. We should already have the, the bridge. Hopefully. To think that this little thing is causing us so much trouble. I just want to kick it to outer space. I suppose all we can do now is to send a signal and hope. Well, ready? Oh, that does not look good. Something's happening. Quick, send it again. What's going on? Oh. Doctor, something's wrong. Oh, what? Take over for me, Lily. Uh oh. His condition has been destabilized. Intake levels must be reconfigured. Oh, that looks really bad. Also, hi, hi, Mandel. Welcome, welcome. What's happening to this place? It's been destabilized. Get out. What? Get out of his memory now. What are you talking about? If the system doesn't restabilize soon, the shock might permanently damage whoever's in here. You've got to be kidding me. Why aren't you getting out then? I can't, Neil. If both of us get out under this state, all, all our work will be reset. There won't be enough time to redo all we've done before Johnny... Oh, you... Freaking... Don't pull that contrived stuff on me! This ain't a movie, you're no hero, you're just being a moron! Then why are you being one too? Get out of here! Nuh-uh, if, if you're gone, then I'll probably pair me up with Alistair! Do you know how badly he smells? Worse than the roadkill. Ugh, oh, Neil. This is what I get for helping you cheat through the endurance exams. <laughs> oh, no. He's stinky. <laughs> oh, God. He helped him cheat during the entrance exams. Of course he cheated. <laughs> Oh, he stabilized! Okay. Doctor? That explains a lot about what. <laughs> I think we're okay for now. Okay, saved. 
They were just fighting to have their hero moment. <laughs> They're still arguing. And guess what? Your carrot cake sucks. Wait a minute. Yeah, and at the last Christmas party, you... Oh. <laughs> Come on, let's go before that happens again. Not the carrot cake. <laughs> um, you know... You know that I didn't mean to, you know, uh, call you a moron, right? You know that I did, right? They got really into that fight. If they really got into that fight. There. Maybe there's a connection up there? Or do we just use the soccer ball again? Maybe we can just use the soccer ball. Cause it doesn't seem like there's any... ...connection on this side. Or wait, maybe? Nope, never mind. Probably just use the soccer ball again. Uh, where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay, soccer ball. Here goes nothing! Okay, let's hope it actually... ...gets us to the other side? <gasps> Yay! It worked! Nice! We finally got here. Let's go! Wow, I can't believe that worked. So we actually made it. But now I'm not sure if I'm gonna like this place. What do you mean? It seems peaceful enough. Neil, did you notice something odd in Johnny's room earlier? Uh, what? There was something strange in there. Did you not see it? I... I suppose not. Never mind. I just hope I'm wrong. Done, done. Oh, we can't talk to them. Done, done. Wow, that sounds fabulous! I know, right? You got to take them there one day. Oh. I didn't see it either. I don't know what they're talking about. I don't know what, what, what strange thing was in the room. I didn't see it. Don Don. Bam bam. <laughs> the suspense is real. Hang it in the house though. Oh. Where's the door to the house? Bam bam. Wow wow. Oh, there he is. Oh. Jeez, the time overlaps getting out of hand. Look at how many of them are there. It's like a zoo. Mm-hmm. Don, Don. Ah, stop moving! Here. Huh, it looks like the ball's moving around its own, and he's just chasing it. I guess we don't get any orbs this time around? Oh, roadkill. All thanks to this little fella's sacrifice. I hope. Wham, wham. Wham, wham. The squirrel is back. It comes back again. Oh, jeez, look at the time. I better get going. The store closes early today. Oh, take care, Martha. Say hello to the boys for me. I will. I'll see you around. Dun dun. Oh, it doesn't make this out anymore. <laughs> well, this is the end of the road. And you were saying... Never mind that. Maybe I was wrong after all. I mean, this place, it's so peaceful. The only thing that exists in this memory that could do such a thing would be... <gasps> Uh-oh. We need to go back. Now. Dun dun. Dun dun. It speeded... Yeah, it's faster. Wait, what's going on now? Just shut up and... Come. Uh-oh. Um, bum. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dun dun. Uh oh. What's going on? Oh. 
Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh no. That's Wait, was that was that his mom? Did she did she did she ran over her own son? Oh oh no. God he's a guy by his mom. Oh Oh no I don't understand. If he was unconscious, how could we be seeing this here when he never did? Still, I'm just surprised that he survived. Actually, he didn't. Uh, what? Didn't you see it in his room, Neil? Johnny slept on a bunk bed. Joey! Joey, can you hear me? Joey? What do you hit Joey, Ma? Oh, wait. Oh, there was a twin. Uh-oh. Why do you hit him? Joey, wake up, Joey. Oh, it's not the grandpa's name. It's the name of the brother. Oh, no. Yeah, he hates being called Jilly because that's his name of his dead twin. Wake up! Oh. Oh, no. Joey. Even though they were young, to lose a twin brother, not to mention how their mother must feel. At least Johnny had the better blockers to erase the memories. Not like he remembers it much. Possibly unlinked, not erased. Oh, man. Somewhere in there, the aftermath of those memories probably linger. What about their mother? I don't think she took the beta blockers. She seems to have gone a little cuckoo. At least I don't really think she called Johnny Julie as a nickname. Yeah, her mother made him forget his own brother. And his mom kept calling him by his brother's name. Yeah, he kept calling him Jelly, which was his twin brother's his name. But if she then takes Johnny for Jelly, what about Johnny himself? I don't like it here. Let's move on. Yeah, that's some that's some tough stuff. Seems like this wasn't the only memory unlinked. Odd. It's not putting up a barrier anymore. Don't jinx it! Yeah, that's that's tough stuff. Yeah, I, I didn't really look at the bunk bed when they mentioned that. So I was like, oh, that's what she meant. Neil, yeah, you should totally give this series a try. I mean, this is wicked awesome. Already plowed through three books straight. Yeah, Joey was the one that liked Animorphs. It wasn't Johnny. Um... I already said it with a bunk bed. I didn't even realize it at all. Yeah, it's very, very subtle. What's it called? Animorphs! Yeah, Joey was the Animorphs fan. Not, not Johnny. It's about this group of kids turning into animals to fight mind-controlling slugs. Meh, I don't like that weird alien stuff. They were opposites. Oh, oh boy. Why not? It's great. 
Instead of going to boring school, they get to turn into tigers and maul big bad aliens. They're all like, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> and then they pick up lasers. And it's all pew, 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 pew. Pew, 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 pew. Stop that. <laughs> Just watch, Johnny. One day, I'm gonna be a famous writer. And I was a laser. <laughs> yeah. The fact that it connects and that explains why he got the stuff wrong. Yeah. I'll write the coolest novel on the block and every kid will get my book for free. I'll make us rich and buy both you and Ma really big houses. Oh my god. Oh no. How would you get rich if you give away the books for free? Pay for the kids. The parents will still have to pay, of course. Yeah, I'm sure the parents will be thrilled to give you money. Yeah, he's definitely the the more serious brother. Uh, Johnny's the more serious one. Joey's like the more, you know... What? You're still mad about the other day? Oh, come on. I call first dibs on the train, fair and square. Is that how that already works? Usually the parents buy it for the kids anyway. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. What happened to your price anyway? I gave it away. To a... Uh... <laughs> Look, it's not just about that day. Oh. You know Ma always favored you. Oh, no. The mom calling him Joey all the time doesn't help either. So it's it's a bunch of different things. Hey, that's not true. Remember last Christmas? And that's why she only remembered Joey. Yeah. And last Easter, and the time we went fishing, and... Okay, okay, you know what? You can actually... You can have my train if you want. Really? Yep! I mean, hey, by your reasoning, she'll just give me another one, right? That... 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 that, that did not make it better. He's... he's not the... he's not the sharpest tool in the shed. But... he... he... he, he means well. <laughs> Listen, Johnny, what difference does it make who owns what? Everything that's mine is yours, too. Throwing salt on the wound, Joey, that doesn't help. <laughs> Yeah, that doesn't help. I mean, we both get to play with it, right? Yeah. Right! I mean, come on. You're my twin brother, dude. You're like a part of me. Oi, let's go confuse the neighbors! They're trying to make it better, but he's still an innocent kid. Yeah. Wait, in the rain? Yes, in the rain. Come on! Aw, oh, man. The Animorphs. Oh, I need to find the memento again. Wherever that is. Oh, is it the train? It is! Oh, man. Yeah, there's quite... There's quite a bit of baggage in this. <laughs> Some kind of carnival, huh? Shall we look around? How about I look around and you just stand here? How about we continue speaking in the form of questions for the next hour? Quit blabbering and go already. Aww, you ruined it. Requires three bars of memory links to proceed. Oh, okay. We need the memory link. Oh, here they are. Yay, carnival to distract us from the pain. Hopefully it's a happy carnival. <laughs> But I don't want this stupid toy. I want the train. That's the only train left. Do you want to exchange your price for a teddy bear instead? No, I just want the train. Now, now, John, don't make a scene. Joey won a fair and square, didn't he? But I won it too. He just went first. Hey, <laughs> it's okay. I'll let you play with it too. See how nice your brother is, Johnny. Oh my god, the mom. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, you dumplings, don't block the stand now. Come on, let's go see what's over there. I'm not a dumpling. The mom does not help at all, yeah. You know what? I'm going to call you dumpling from now on. You're bluffing. Hey, is that whack-a-mole? Whack-a-what? Whack-a-mole! You take a mallet and whack moles. Isn't that animal abuse? They're fake moles, butthead. I tell people blew up steam before FPS are invented. <laughs> oh my god. How primitive. Yeah, it's, it's, it's pretty interesting. Where do you read about that? My grandpa was a fan. Wanna play? Just hit everything on the head and you win! Yes, 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 yes! Uh... Sure. You smiles. Oh, you smiles. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. Ah! I messed up! My mouse input! Okay. Oh god, I missed that. Oh. Okay, did I get the prize? <laughs> Let's see now. Out of 47 total target appearances, you struck 54 times and made 45 successful hits. Oh god, they take my... Uh, none. 45... Out of 47 targets, I only missed one. That's a 95% hit rate. I'll take that. I'll take my 95% hit rate. It's your new record. Thank you. <laughs> I'll take a 95%. I think that's, that's a pretty neat uh, percentage. What's a lot Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome, welcome, Raiders. Hope that you had a good stream, Lottie and Lottie lads. Oh. Ah, uh, yes. Fortunes of Wonder are ahead for you. This one might just become a lawyer, and this one, a doctor. Oh, my! Oh, yeah, the, the typical lawyer and doctor. <laughs> 95%, that's an A on your whack-a-mole grade. I kind of I kind of want to play whack-a-mole again. Like, actual whack-a-mole. Not, not like, virtual whack-a-mole. <laughs> Come on, I'm getting both of you treats. Oh, lawyer and doctor. Hey, where's my tip? Nah, fortune teller did not get any tips. GG. For fortune teller. <laughs> oh no. Uh, can we check anywhere else on the carnival? The violent allegations? What is this game about? Um, you're basically... You play as these two doc... I guess you can call them doctors, technically. They are called Dr. Rosaline and Dr. Watts. Um... You basically are trying to get the, um... Trying to get this guy to go to the moon, and you pretty much are altering... Well, not really altering his memories, per se. More than trying to create the desire so he makes his dream of going to the moon real, if that makes sense. It's kind of hard to explain it. In paper. <laughs> Hi, Tiaki. Those little pixel Tiakis on the side are so cute. Thank you. Hiroli was the one that made them. I don't know if they're still in chat right now. But... Yeah, they they were the ones that made the little pixel... The little pixel Tiakis in the corner. It's pretty late into the game, though. I mean, the whole memory altering is the... Pro is uh, pretty much the premise, so... Wait a minute. Tomatoes aren't fruits. They are. Uh, yeah, they are. They're the ovaries of the plants and contain seeds. That's what a fruit is. But come on, tomatoes! We never ever refer to them as fruits, but they are fruits. We? Who? I happen to enjoy cooking in groups, okay? Some of us take it very seriously. You keep telling yourself that, Watts. <laughs> oh, gosh. We need one last memory orb. But... I can't seem... Oh, maybe this crew. Here. Welcome and behold! The world's smallest Ferris wheel! It really is very small. Can we ride it? Absolutely not! 
Does it even work? Absolutely not! <laughs> Looks like someone just glued some chairs to a water wheel! <laughs> Wait, that is true! It actually does look like that. Don't know, don't care. Okay, we got three memories. That's all we needed. <laughs> That's all we needed. We got, we got the three. The three that we need. <laughs> oh, God. The water wheel. <laughs> The world's smallest fairies wheel. Ooh, what's this? Fire? Da 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 da. Oh, here they are. Mm hmm. I can never understand you, Joey. How can you stand the taste of them? They're just so sour and icky. Oh, it's the pickled olives. Sour and awesome is what you mean. Just try it. Nah, I don't even want to taste regular olives. You should try at least one, Johnny. Who knows, maybe you'll like it. The pickled olive origins, yeah, it all... It is all explained. Yeah! Mmm, mmm. I'm done, though. Can I go play? Okay, but only at the playground and not an inch too far. But the olive's liking was forced by his mother, I'm pretty sure a lot of his, um... Early likes were probably forced by his mother to act like Joey. Just leave that bag, I'll keep it for you. No, it's mine. I want it. Uh, pickle olives. Anything else over here? Oh. I wanna see if there's anything on the other side. Nope, there's not. Okay. Yeah, this is... this is yikes. <laughs> I thought the carnival was just gonna be fun. She probably forced them on him because she kept thinking it was Joey. Yeah. Oh wait, is this him mitting River? For the first time? I wonder. I don't think he's gonna meet her here, to be fair. Or maybe? Maybe, maybe. Way to follow mom's orders, huh? It's gonna be their first meeting. Because back when we first saw them as high schoolers, he already liked her. So I wonder. Oh. What's up? Where are you going? Wasn't the first time they met Rune by Nick? No, that was when he was asking her out, wasn't it? Wow. Ooh, pretty! Whoa! Oh, this is really pretty. And we're just casually watching him. <laughs> Well, okay, so he wandered off the trail and found a cool place. But let's face it, he could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. It's the Milky Way. Is it? I couldn't... Well, we can't see it from here. Tigers don't travel in packs, idiot. It was just an expression. Ba, 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 ba. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Yeah... There was a hill outside of the city that we would stay at, the same one every year. We would watch the stars till daybreak. Well, I did mostly. He just carried the telescope for me. Of course. The thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always told her that we were just camping and hit the telescope inside the car. That's all good, but when we got back in the morning, I had to pretend like I'd actually slept. So in conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. <laughs> oh my god, I thought it was actually gonna be like an emotional story. <laughs> that's how I started my caffeine addiction. Emotional moment ruined out the window. You are terrible. I know. <laughs> At least he's aware. Does lots have emotions even? I Maybe 
We meant to watch her win his own emotional moment. Yup. It's a shame, though. All these nice memories, lost and never found. And who knows how many more like it. Well, as you say, just take it moment for a moment, right? Mm-hmm. Oh! <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh! I told you packs of tigers dwell here. Hmm? There's a river. Oh, it is! I was right! Oh, beep! <laughs> really getting use of the beep today. This game apparently has a lot of sections in order to use the beep. Hello! They actually. No, wait! Wait, don't go! They actually met each other. I'm um, Donnie. What's your name? You're at my spot. Uh, your spot? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. Um, you wanna join me? Are you here to watch the stars? Are you? Aww, that was their first meeting. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, but these were repressed memories, so he doesn't actually remember this moment. So remember, these were memories that were repressed by the by the blockers because of what happened. So, oh, this is really pretty. Whoa, CG moment. Just look at them. They were so happy. You know there were so many lights in the sky. Yes. Oh, uh, I did too. That's why why he didn't remember the first actual meeting. Yeah. You saw this was your spot, right? Only during the carnival. Not a fan of the crowds. Me neither. You know, you still haven't told me your name yet. I'm not telling you. Everyone makes fun of it in school. Why? They say it makes them want to go to the washroom. Uh, okay then? Well, it can't be worse than John. What's wrong with the name John? <laughs> I mean, everywhere, everywhere in the world, nearly everyone's named John. There's so many Johns, apparently. Even in India? Probably. What's wrong with that? Hmm? What's wrong with having a name that everyone has? Well, it's boring, I guess. I mean, if everyone has it, then what's the point? I wouldn't mind. Just for once, you have the same name everyone else has. Yeah, Don is one of the most common names. It is, yeah. It's like those lights in the sky. They all look the same from here, but that doesn't make them any less pretty. Uh, I suppose. What do you think those stars up there are anyways? My dad said they're giant burning spheres of gas. Oh, uh, I bet he's just making it up. Why would he lie to me? Because, you know, that's what grown-ups do. They make things up. Santa, Easter Bunny, Kangaroos, stuff like that. <laughs> kangaroos? Hold up. What about that third one? <laughs> kangaroos are not real. Confirm. <laughs> oh my god. Have you ever made an Easter Bunny out of stars? Donnie, we're supposed to be the smart one. <laughs> Like a constellation? Yes. Um, of other things, never tried a rabbit though. Do you want to make one? Yeah, we'll make the bestest constellation ever. Let's see who makes one first. Da -da -da. Ba -da. Okay, we'll start in three. 
Three, two, one, and start! I see it. Uh, where? In the sky. Um, but where in the sky? Think big. Uh... Bigger than all the others. I don't know. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see it. Tell me what you see. There, right? They're the two ears in the head. Wait, I, I don't know if I'm seeing it or if I'm like losing it. <laughs> I can't like I can I can see this maybe as the ears, but like <laughs> Remember when Ribri asked, tell me what you see? Probably referring to this moment, yeah. What else? Yeah, she's she's saying the same thing she used to say before. And there! There it's it's two feet! Yes? What else? And and the moon! The moon is its big round belly! Oh yeah, there it is! It got the ears. Oh, and he couldn't answer because he had lost the memory. Yeah, he, he didn't get it. So, what do you think they really are? The stars, I mean. I... I've never told anyone, but... I've always thought they were lighthouses. Billions of lighthouses. Stuck at the far end of the sky. Wow, it must be so lively up there. But it isn't. They can see all the other lighthouses out there, and they want to talk to them. But they can't, because they're all too far apart to hear what the others are saying. All they can do is shine their lights from afar. So that's what they do. They shine their lights at the other lighthouses, and at me. Yeah, this they I think this was what she said on Act Three. It was uh, written on the thing that said Act Three. Why you? Because one day I'm going to befriend one of them. That bag, what's in it? Oh, it's the price I won from Whackamole. Do you get to play that game? I try, but I'm too clumsy. What did you get from it? I got a... thing... I don't really know what it is. It's the platypus! Oh, that's why she... That's why she really held the platypus close. Some kind of a weird duck beaver thing. May I see it? The platypus! It looks so strange. I wish I could win one myself. Johnny? Eek, that's them all calling. Here. You know what? Keep it. It's yours. M mine? Yeah, I can always get another. I don't like to brag, but I'm totally the best at that game. Will you be here next year? Yep, will you? Yes. Same place, same time? Yes. Oh no. What if you forget or get lost? Oh, not the forgetty. Not the forget. Then we can always regroup on the moon, silly. Right on the rabbit's tummy. Johnny! Coming! Oh yeah, I forgot my hacky sucky in the bag. You say you're clumsy, right? Maybe you'll help. On the moon. Yeah, and there it is. Aw, oh, man. And he never showed up. If they ever get lost? Wait, does that mean... Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. Well, that's why he didn't 
He didn't need to go to the moon afterwards, yeah, because he forgot about that. And here I thought this was going to be an inspirational childhood dream story. I should have known that some girl would come along and turn it into a cheese fest. I suppose now we know what we must do to send him to the moon. Wait, you aren't actually going to do it, are you? It's our job, Neil. It's what we're contracted to do. Eva, wait! Eva. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I know you're in here. Oh, God, we need to find the... Uh, uh, oh, platypus? Okay, no, not related. Uh, let's see. Well, he's here right now. No. Gotta get out of here. This, I don't think this is gonna be good. Oh, there she is! I see you! Turn around! Neil? I know what you're planning to do. I know that you know. Yeah? Well, I know that you know that I... Look, our contract is to send him to the moon. And the only way for that to happen is if Johnny is motivated to do so. But if that means removing River, then what's the point? The reason why he even wants to go to the moon in the first place is because she died! I know, but we're illegally bound by the contractor specifically. The contract! <laughs> I just pressed the, the, the button. <laughs> I didn't take this job to make him miserable, Eva. I don't know about you, but I signed up to help the geezers I happy. Me too, and I like this job. But if we directly go against our legal obligations, we'll be in for court hearings. We'll appeal! We know that Johnny will be happier to not go to the moon. Johnny would be happier with a lot of alternate life tangents, Neil. We're not here to play God. Our job is to give him what he signed for. Well, we happen to know what he wants better than he does. Look, I'm only risking losing River because I believe in her, and... What do you mean, Risk? You're removing her! And besides, I'll make up for it. Make up for it how? Oh. We're running out of time. Just trust me. Says the one who pushed me off the lighthouse! Uh-oh. Oh, this is not good. Did you just... Uh-oh. Oh, the light data. Abusing your powers doesn't disable my controls entirely, Ava. Uh oh. Oh god! Booby traps? Really, Ava? Just trying to buy some time. Gee, thanks for telling me. Oh god. Ah! My god, is he. Oh my god! Ah, the books! Those are some expensive pieces of equipment you're tossing. Seriously, just stay put in a way till I'm done. Oh god. I need to move up. Oh. She's changing the positioning. That's annoying. Uh, where are you? Oh, this fucked. Look, don't make me exit this whole thing and unplug you. Would you really risk distorting his memories as they are? Just stop trying, please. This won't take long. Ugh, not again. Or come and find me at the end of the hall. Oh god. Uh, Stop. Oh! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Oh, you've got to be freaking ki- Is this a game to you, Ava? Dear lord, they aren't just zombie Avas. They're zombivas. D don't come any closer. I got plants. Oh. Okay. Oh, the, the wrong way. Blech. Ah! Oh god. Blech. 
god, there's so many of them! Oh god! Oh god, Ugh, get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. They keep respawning! Wait, ugh. Ah, the spikes! Wait. Oh, she's at the end of the hall! Oh god. Uh oh. I'm stuck in the corner. Get out of here, get out of here. Phew, these things are good for something after all. Plants vs. Zombies reference. Oh, that, that's another zombie one. Come on, get out of the way. Get out of here. Uh, wait, is the hall just endless? What? Oh god, no. She added these. God, get Ah! Get out of the way. Play. Yeah, is it just endless? So far it is. This whole thing is just a loop. Oh god, she's forcing me to loop. Oh! Oh, f this! Oh god. Oh, nice! We found a loop. What the? Let's get out. Okay, did we escape the loop? Oh god. Ava? What happened? Ava? Uh oh, what did she do? Oh. Oh, wait, he's gone. Wait, River is. She's still here? Oh, uh oh. It's Child, the River, and uh. Her old woman self. Oh no. She's messing with the memories. Oh no, that's not good. Oh, jeez. Oh my god, the horses! <laughs> oh, there's more paper rabbits in here. Um, piano. Oh. Oh no, that's the... That's jelly. Here? Oh look, it was a long time ago. There's no date or time, Johnny. Now the whole construct's messed up. Yeah, it's messed up the entire context of the conversation. Uh-oh. That's not good. Uh, phone? Phone. Hello? Hello, Neil. Morpheus? What? It's Ava, you idiot. No! No! We're the only ones here! Listen, whatever you've been doing, stop it. We might not know what Johnny wants, but we know what he doesn't want. And what he doesn't want is exactly what you're accelerating. It's already done, Neil. Uh-oh. I really love the bleeping! It just keeps... It just keeps telling me to use that symbol! It's just a bunch of symbols! I'm like, what do I use? Why didn't you come out now? Okay. Here we are. Oh, what did he do? What did she do? <gasps> oh, what is going on? What? Is she getting bullied? What do you do to her? Relax. She's really going elsewhere. I don't. I don't think that's. What's going on? You know, it's one thing to disable my controls to feed me some olives. But this is way out of line. I'm sorry, but this just won't go anywhere if you keep on resetting the memory. At this point, this is the only way. I'm asking you to trust me. So please, just calm down and wait here. 
Then just pull the trigger already. Where are you going? There's just one last thing I need to do. Poser, there's no need to visualize a door. What's with all the melodrama, Neil? Why are you fighting so hard for this? Forget it. There's no time. Everything will be alright, man. Just turn around. Okay. Okay. Hey, hey, what are you? Shh. She's not there, though. Ahem. Hell. Aww. She's not there anymore. Sorry, kid. It's already started. Oh man. Come on, they're gonna hog all the good tables. They're all the same, sheesh. Nah, Joey's right. The ones by the kitchen smell better. Wait, Joey's alive in this one? Totally, and olive refills are just steps away. Ugh, olives. What does she do? Saving him doesn't justify it. He can always find another river, Neil. But he'll only have one brother. D oh, it's it's a racing river to save the brother. Ah, oh, that's so that's so bad. What do you mean? Come on, we're in the way. Ah, oh, that's so that's so mean. The worst part is that river didn't need to be erased. Sacrificing one for the other, yeah. That would mean this entire thing would not happen then, because yeah. Ah, oh, that's 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 things. <laughs> yeah, the memory is gone. Just stood there, doubted for an answer. When this, this world, world is no more, the darkness I will see. I'll ask you to fly away with me. Still, the scars all fall down. From the sky, but I don't mind if you're with me, then everything's alright. Man, not like this. Why do, I do my words? Always lose their meaning What I feel What I say There's such a rift between them She said I can't Really seem to leave you I just Stood there Never knowing what to do When this, this world is no more The moon is all we'll see I'll ask you to fly away with me Until the stars all fall down They empty from the sky but I don't mind If you're with me Then everything's alright If you're with me Then everything's 
Sad moment hours. Same. Julie's dream of being famous already came true at least. Ooh, I guess. Yeah, but... Oh, man. The sacrifice is... NASA! I mean, this is a simulation, not actually altering reality. I mean, still, you're 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 injecting that in his memories, though. So it's pretty much making him remember because obviously they had to the simulation they had to put it into his head. So he actually wants to go to the moon. You actually made it, huh? You sound surprised. Whatever happened to we always succeed because we're awesome? This isn't a success. Oh, lighten up! We're in NASA! Yeah, the same as altering reality as far as he's concerned. Exactly. Remember, he's on his deathbed, so... It will be his reality. Till the, you know... Till the day he passes. So for him, it is altering reality. We don't have much time left. Let's at least check this place out. Now, this rewrites his memories. Yeah, which is kind of like why it has like a very... Bitter feeling. Please wait here. Someone will come and show you around shortly. Sheesh, she really likes his backpack. Yeah, Neil is very, very quiet now. How pathetic. Oh, this job was just for some girl. That's what I thought you would say, Neil. How pathetic. Oh, this job was just for some girl. There you go. Good to have you back. Yeah, yeah. Okay, anyone else here? What's up with people wanting to go to the moon and it being a sad story? <laughs> Not sure. Oh, I need one bar of memory. Uh, backpack? No, backpack's not related. Man, it just, just sad. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this song is gonna get copyrighted because I, I forgot to... <laughs> I forgot to mute it, but I really like this song, so I didn't want to mute it. <laughs> I didn't want to mute this song because it's a really pretty song. I really like it. But alas. I can't believe it is actually sold. This isn't the real world, Neil. Wait, wait, what did it say? To the moon, the story about a lame duck's attempt to become an astronaut, a novel by Joey Wiles. <laughs> Sacrifice her VOD for the karaoke. Such a noble sacrifice. <laughs> okay. I'm assuming we can't access this. Oh, yeah. Four bars. We need more. That's probably the final delay. Um... Is it new or is this elevator smaller on the inside? Right, let's go floor two. Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da. Okay, here we are. This is the Mission Control Center. What river? There's not much going on now, but you'll see it live one day. I half expected a Zordon on that screen. It's not here. Oh, uh, what? Let's just go. Hey. Is there anything else in here? I don't think so. Maybe the are chill and don't have a copyright flag for this song. It's a small indie dev. I... maybe. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> She's looking for something, apparently. So, whoa... So, do you think last century's moon landing was... Let's not, Neil. Let's not. Okay, floor three. Okay, here we are. And here's a centrifuge. If you're lucky, you'll learn to hate it one day. <laughs> ah, yes, the spinny thingy. It's not here either. What are you talking about? Come on, we don't have long left. Okay, we're missing two and one floor, so... Your records are excellent, but we'll have to monitor your status closely in the coming sessions. Anything else in here? Nope, nothing here. 
Damn, she's not that cruel. Yeah, but even YouTube who copy strikes artists for their own songs and it feels like it. Yeah. It's kind of like the big thing. <laughs> oh, the real NASA has bigger elevators. Okay, fourth floor? Maybe I can find the last two in there. Or probably it. We just need one more to access the door in the first floor. The shuttle's still under heavy maintenance. We may only view it from here for now. Ugh, oh, this isn't good. Perhaps there's somewhere there's somewhere we missed. Uh, you need to work on your communication skills. Uh, we're missing one orb though. Whoa. Yeah. You know what? You know what's the best part of it? What? The very top and bottom of the shuttle. I would have to agree. Oh, how I pity anyone who can't see those particular parts. Indeed, especially its nose at the top. When maintenance finishes, it probably won't look the same. Yeah, that was the only time. Okay, there you go. We got the last one. Da, 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 da. It's probably... It, it, I think it's probably... If it gets bonged, it's probably the, the copyright bot. Because YouTube has copyright bots. Okay. Let's see over here. Last... This has to have the last door in here. I wonder if the real NASA looks like this. Probably not. It's constructed in part with Johnny's beliefs, after all. Ah, yes. A wiki of existing facts tainted by personal fairy tales. Hmm... It's odd, though, to hear birds and see none. Mm. Sorry, Neil. I really thought there was a good chance. What? Oh. And this is the break room. Here's David. He's a mission specialist. Nice to meet you. Is he David from Animorphs? <laughs> At least he got into NASA, I guess. You think he made it to the end? Even if he did, it would take more than just a few years to become an astronaut. Let's hurry and find the last link then. I would hate to miss the finale. Oh no. What's going on? Are we out of time? I... I don't know. Uh oh. <gasps> it's her! Ah, and here's our other new recruit. River, right? Good to have you on board. She back! She here! Hello, I'm John. Phew! I almost thought she wasn't... What the, Eva? But you deleted her. No, I told you, I just moved her. Um, um. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. What she does with her life here is still up to her. But this new world, it's based on public data and Johnny's on beliefs. One. Also, hi, hi, Cooper. Welcome, welcome. I'm doing good. And since River's date as an individual is not recorded in the public domain, it all comes from Johnny. But even then, that merely increases the odds. How are you sure that it will work? It was. I wasn't. She gambled. I could have gone very badly, you know. You were never one to take risks, Neil. Let's just say I won this round. Ooh, we were so close to losing it. We still have two spare helmets, right? I think Johnny would appreciate some company. Bum bum. See, Tiaki, the gamble always pays off. That's not true. It could have gone very badly. What if, what if we had lost the gamble? It would have all been over. Also, thank you for the gift, Dirimo. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much for recruiting a new member into Nylena. 
could have lost that 50-50. Exactly. They could have lost it. And it would have all been over right then and there. It could it literally predestinated? That's not true. It it could have it could have still gone wrong. He wrote it himself, apparently. Rather repetitive, you ask me though. What a critic. What's it called? To the moon. <gasps> Title drop. I like that name. Besides, we only had 48 hours. We didn't have time to mess it up. Actually, less than 48. We lost our first night, so we had, like... We had less than 48 hours. We had less than a day, probably. Like the third title job. <laughs> it's the important title job. This is the, the one. This is the, the real one, TM. The one. We're all wearing helmets? I guess we all want to go to NASA. The true title drop. Yes, the, the big one, the important one. Wow. To the moon, TM. The other title drops were just teasers for the real one. Exactly. Oh, there you are. You two should go get some rest. Tomorrow's the big day. They're going to the moon! For realsies! <gasps> it is time! The time is now! Dun dun dun! Um... Ba da ba 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 ba! Ba da ba ba! Ba da ba ba! Ba da ba 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 ba! It's time! Whoa. Get to see the launch. I wanna be an astronaut too, Dad! One day, son, you just smite. Meh. The centrifuge is renowned for making peekable hurl upon their first time. I've heard. You should have seen him back when we went to school together. I swear, the guy never rested. He just kept on trying and trying. It was like he only had one goal to work for. Do you think that they would make it? Ha! <laughs> Did you? No. The way she is, I didn't think she would succeed. But I... I guess I was wrong. All the better, then. Yes, I'm happy for them. Oh, oh. oh I can't... No! I thought I could get on that spot. Hey, Dr. Watts, right? Thank you for letting us in here. Yeah, yeah. Eve is the one who requested it. Can you find out why he wanted to go to the moon? Sure. And? What, what all happened here? Let's just say it was a bunch of sappy cheese that sorted itself out. Can we... Oh. Talking to Doctor. You know, there were quite a few times last night when I thought we lost Johnny. I think he consciously held on to wait for you two. He's rather patient then. I would just hope it's worth the wait. Go on now, your colleague's waiting. Okay, now we can go. It's time. We gotta watch the launch. I thought this might be a good view. Good enough to cut off the traffic, eh? Sure, even if they were real. Well, this is it. All we'll work for. Ready to initiate it? Yes. It's time. Come up here. Uh, why? Why not? You're just gonna push me off the ledge again, aren't you? Probably. But the view's worth the odds. Take my hand. Come on. It's time. The big moment. Bum, 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 bum. They'll finally reach the moon. The title would finally be a reality. 
Long live the king pushes Watts off. <laughs> oh no. No, he can't die before he reaches the moon! Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh, come on. He... Because one day, I'm going to befriend one of them. Oh no. He's not gonna reach it! Come on, go faster, go faster! Go, 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 go! Step on it, step on it! <laughs> it can't end like this, it just can't! He's gotta reach the moon! He's gotta! There he goes. Okay, the shuttle... The shuttle's off! It's off, it's out! Ground control to Major Tiaki! <laughs> Initiate launch. Go, 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 go. We did it. <laughs> did she just smack him? She's like, no. Reject <laughs> There's the lighthouse. There's Anya. It all came full circle. Wow. What a story. What a narrative. And now they married later in life. Yeah, they I think they ended up getting married later now. Uh-oh. Uh oh no. Uh oh. He's not gonna get there! He's not gonna get there! Step on it! Oh no. That's not good. Oh no. It's right there! It's right there! Step on it! Oh no. Come on, tell me that at least they made it. They stepped on it at the very end, they made it. Man. Yeah, the hand holding at the very end. Wow. They totally made it. They have to have made it. Come on. It was literally like right there. <laughs> literally right in front of them. It's about the journey, not about getting there. But like, getting there is like a big part in this particular case. That was his wish. They made it in my heart. It has to be canon that they made it. Wow. That was... That was a journey, man. He found her by the moon, so in that sense, he achieved this goal. I guess true. That is indeed true. Actually, it is true. It's about your trip companion, not the trip itself. But I mean, they were already together before. I mean, that's it. At least they died trying. I guess, yeah. They... They were really close to the moon, though. They saw it. It was right there. They at least managed to see it, so... See it up close, not just seeing it in the sky, I mean. <laughs> but yeah. They did it together. That's why he didn't need to... To go to the top of the to the moon. He was already with River. He never wanted to go to the moon. Then why was he th the entire wish about going to the moon though? Cause they just moved River away, just so he would want to go to the moon. But they wouldn't. They wouldn't have contact with the other people if it wasn't like a wish. Because he forgot to the memory loss. Yeah. The main point of the moon was because it was the reason they were together. Yeah, the meeting from when they were kids. Yeah. 
Here he is already gone. Here he is. Thanks. Off you go now. I still can't believe Johnny just willed the house to Lily like that. <laughs> Who else was there to give it to? Us? Terrible place for burials, though. If there's a landslide, they'll be swimming with the fishes. Still a little too soon. Nah, it's never soon enough. Nice new ringtone! Hello, Eva here. We're on our way. New patient? New patient. Let's roll! Watch trust the line of being insensitive and not... Oh. Is he dying? He forgot about River in the meeting. The moon was the... Was the way to remind him of that. The paper rabbit is River's way of trying to tell him to remember. I guess it's trying to make him remember it through the rabbit they saw. Yeah. There is Finding Paradise and Imposter Factory. That is true. There's just two other games. Oh, was that? I think there's an implication. Oh, it just closes automatically like that. Okay. <laughs> game's, uh, the game's done. <laughs> we finished the game. Yeah, game has two other games. But yes. <laughs> oh my god, it's almost six hours. <laughs> I did need to go eat because I haven't had lunch, but yeah, it was it was it was quite a journey. It was definitely quite 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 a journey. Are you planning to do the other two sequels? I do want to try them out. I actually do own Finding pa Paradise. I have find I have Finding Paradise, but I don't have the other game. I don't have Imposter Factory. I just have Finding Paradise. So. We, I, I, I will play Finding Paradise. I do want to see where the story goes. But yes, I haven't had lunch at all. <laughs> Koi Tiaki must be starving. I am hungry. I am indeed hungry. So... We shall see. Let's see, who is... Da, 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 da. Let's see who is live right now. Need to stream the is to carry in about six hours. <laughs> this six hours. Oh almost six hours, geez. Because uh I wanted to finish this game in one in one sitting. So I mean it was doable. It was doable to finish it. Really love this story, one of the best out there. And having someone on the spectrum is really interesting. Yeah, it was really it was a really interesting story. I it really, really liked it. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your super atarato. And also Raps, thank you so much for the tip. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the stream. That was a lot of fun. Go eat your food and hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thank you. I shall go. I shall go see what I eat. Thanks for the stream. I heard the game before, but first time actually seeing someone play it. Very it's a, I've heard lots of good things about it. It was a really, really nice game. Really enjoyed it. I feel like they balance the humor and like, you know, the more serious uh, side of the game really well. So it wouldn't feel like it was like being really serious all the time. I think it was pretty good that they managed to balance it out pretty well. Uh, let me see. Congrats on another game finished. Enjoy dinner and have a good night. Thank you. Send you guys to. I think Nova is live. Yeah, Nova is live right now. How will send you guys over to her? Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you so much, everyone. I'll be sending you guys over to Novina Nova. She's currently playing One Hand Clapping. Here is our raid message. Here's the raid message. And now, I shall see you guys next week. So, bye-bye. Bye-bye, bye-bye. Ciao. Bye.